Well, Not we hair. are. How come everybody laughs when I do that, huh? <laughs> Your signature. Should I do that again or should I just keep going? Should Come I keep on. rolling let's, with let's, it? Let's make it nice. One more? Yeah. Okay. Well, we are back. We're back at the Nine Club, everybody. Listen, man, I'm excited tonight. We got a special guest, Alex. Everyone's a special guest on your show. Okay, well, what do you want to be called? No, then? no, no, it's fine. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just making you aware. Extraordinary. Thank you. Yes. Extraordinary that's, that's guest. Good. Thank you. Alex, Extra special. Alex Olson <laughs> is here. What's good, dude? Yeah, not much. Hey, th- no? Okay. Thanks for coming then. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Hey, what are, you, um, what are you doing here, bro? You're in town for a little bit? Because you live in New York. Right. Right. Uh, I was here for the holidays and oh, okay. I have a storage unit that I've had for about four years now. Oh, N- you know. what, do you, what do you got in there? Uh, well, Skateboarding relics or just uh, bullshit? D- d- all, everything. Everything. Tools, turntables. turntables. Oh, yeah. Stereo system. Nice. Piano. Like, piano? Yeah. You play piano? I tried. Yeah. I could play the... <laughs> I, I, mean, I mean, yeah, yes, I do, yeah. but I don't. No. I, I wouldn't pre- impress anyone. No. I could explain a lot of stuff to you. Oh, really? I, I don't have the... I didn't put in the time, the miles. In. How many keys are there on a piano? 88? <laughs> That's right. 88 keys. See? I know nice. some shit. I know some <laughs> shit. So storage unit, holidays, visiting pops. Yeah. Sleeping on a cot. And, oh really? Because you know, he's got a little studio, like an army cot, like a green, like a, or just a normal. Like, I flew out here, yeah. and then I was like, "Well, I don't know where I'm going to stay. My dad doesn't have a place." Okay. Is he still sleep? living behind the uh, yeah. pizza place? Yeah. Oh, sick. well, uh, I mean, it's uh, now it's a hookah shop, so oh, well, it's a nightmare. Like Is I, it? I get like, you know, violently mad <laughs> at these people. <laughs> Why? Because Can of you the... still cut through the hookah shop. To... No, no, no. It's not like that. No? It's just like they have this hookah shop, and then just like they. At night, they use the the parking lot for for everyone, oh. so there's no parking. Are they hooking it up, or they, or is it like you buy the hookahs there? No, it's like a like a club, like a hookah. lounge. Okay, oh, wow. did you go in there and partake? In no, the- no, no. <laughs> but like a New Year's, it was like they oh. like fucking blasted, you know, at three in the morning. Jeez, I have earplugs though. So. You do. <laughs> well, yeah, uh, the yeah. funny thing is, I came and I was like, I don't know where I'm gonna sleep. I was like, I need to get earplugs because my dad snores to a okay insane level, right? And then I was like. Where am I going to get, I want to get this because I like to camp or whatever. And okay. so I would like nerd out on that stuff. And I was like, oh, I really want to get this thing on the X-Bed. What does it do? It's just like an air mattress, but like a better version. It oh, really? Air, you know, it has uh, memory foam, blah, blah, blah. Whoa. Glamping. Yeah, yeah, exactly. kind of, yeah. I, I mean, it's meant, it's not meant to like hike and it's like if you have a car and. Okay. Great. But, uh, so I went to the REI and. They didn't have it and I was just tripping and then whatever, I got this caught. Yeah. And I love the thing. Really? Oh, it's amazing. And you could fold it up. Are you gonna yeah, take it? Folds up. You're gonna yeah. take it home? No, I'm leaving that. You're leaving Oh, that's your place to stay when you <laughs> yeah, come back. Here. Exactly. Okay. I've I've gotten so comfortable that I'm like, oh fuck, I don't even want to go back home right now. There you it's go. It's snowing, so Oh yeah, that's true. Well, have you been skating while you're out here or just uh business? Mm, uh, trying. Because of, uh, both the, trying. Well trying the nine to do business trying to skateboard. Because the nine one seven offices are here, right? Or are they yeah, in they're both. Oh, they're both. Oh, you have. Oh, wow. By coastal. By coastal. By huh? coastal. <laughs> big, big, big things. Yeah, I guess big so. Big things. How does that work though? You have like people out here doing shit. And the warehouse have... is here. Oh, the warehouse. And then like I just have an office there. Oh. To whatever. Oh, sick. Where in New York do you live? In Greenpoint. Where is that um, relative to like Manhattan? Or... Um, it's Brooklyn, and okay. there and there's Williamsburg, yeah. and then there's Greenpoint. Oh, so you're kind of like out there. Somewhat. Yeah. It's it's not. It's really hard to. It's inconvenient to get to, mm, but okay. I ride a bike, so. Oh, what kind of fixed gear? No, 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 no. <laughs> City bike? Just a Trek, a Trek Chromali. Do you have gears and stuff? You, of course, yeah. of okay. course, the, uh, like Triptonics. No way, this Not is like a fancy bike. I mean, you know, I had like a Linus that was like just a three speed. Okay, yeah. And it was just a nightmare. I mean, it wasn't, it was great. It, right. had like, it was like, it felt like a, like a, you know, I had a back rack and I had a skateboard rack on oh. it and all this and, uh. That was great, but then yeah. I was just like, dude, it takes too long to get over the fucking bridge. I want the Ferrari. How much does a bike like that cost? Oh, 300 bucks. 300 bucks. That's not bad. Yeah, Craigslist. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm a big Craigslist guy. Are you a Craigslister? Oh, yeah. But wait, you got to meet up with these people, though. You, That's you can't the send... fucking high right no. there. <laughs> Are you, yes, you're not dude, scared when you that. meet up with these? Oh, of course. I'm like, dude, I could get murdered yeah, right now. Exactly. This is amazing. Right. You know? I don't fuck with that shit. No, no, no. Because you meet really like 
interesting people that way. I'm sure you do. It's like catfish without the romance. <laughs> <laughs> like, is this, is this, does this dude really have a bike for me to buy right now? Dude, I'm buying something tomorrow. I hope it works. Seriously? On yeah. Craigslist? Yeah. And where are you meeting this person? I, I don't know. I can't you don't disclose know. the location. Oh, you can't <laughs> disclose. Okay. No, but uh, I don't know. Public place, though, obviously. Uh, Starbucks, maybe. Sometimes, dude, I've bought weird stuff and gone to people's houses that are really fucking weird. No. Like, I bought some, you know, a lot of synthesi old synthesizers and stuff. Do me a favor, bro. When you go to these places, just tell somebody where you're going. You know, just tell somebody where you're going. No, it's even and... better, man. <laughs> Gone baby. Have you seen that? <laughs> just be careful, bro. Okay. We're, we worry about you. <laughs> Thank you. You grew up out here? Yes. Yeah. Santa Monica. Santa Monica. Then, slash and then Malibu. We, and then, yeah. Skated with this kid when he was a uh, youngster. You know, yeah. Him and, it was surprising because like, you know, I'd, ha I'd hang out in Malibu all the time. And then right. here's Steve Olson, you know. Right. And uh, and then there's you. Yeah, but that wasn't, there was like, you were just like this figure that like, oh, Chris Roberts, he sells you, you know, he'll sell you a used board. Yeah, that's right. I'm like, oh, that's I right. fucking, I'm, you know, just like being a kid, like I need to use, a, I need a new board. 10 bucks. Right. 15 if it's I a remember shape. getting a DECA board off yeah. you. Deca? It sucked. What the fuck was I doing with a DECA board? It was spray painted. Oh, interesting. Oh, I don't Man. remember that. Right. So anyways. Papa Jacks. Papa park. Jacks. Yeah. I, uh, me and uh, Blake Mills were yeah. a part of that. You had a good crew out there though. Who yeah. I mean, I, I I love those Dusty guys. Dusty and, and uh, Connor. Do you still talk to all those dudes? Yeah, they're all just construction workers now. Oh, seriously? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. From from my point of view, yeah. I think the piss drunks. We got really influenced by that. Okay. Well, I didn't. I can't say I did, but right. They got really into it, drinking. Yeah. At that age, and okay. You know, like skating became less f fun. Let's right. go out and tonight. Then, and then so from there, I mean, well, growing up with with Olsen, your dad. I'm just yes. calling him Olsen. No, no, no. Yes, okay. Olsen. No, no, I know who you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, okay. Well, I mean, I'm aware like, of the lingo. But like growing, growing up with your dad, like how was that like, you know, with the whole, you know, him being a, you know, a pro, pro and then you, um, what, did you get into skating because he was that or you just find it on your own? Yes and no. no. Uh, so I lived with my mom until I was around 10. Okay. And then my dad took responsibility and I was like, hey, can you live with me? Okay, sick. And so I started going to Malibu High School. Mm-hmm. Well, middle school, but uh, that's where I started meeting all these new kids and yeah. skating kind of was on the rise. Okay, and yeah. I just wanted to fit in, so I was oh, like, yeah, yeah wow. uh, I, I skateboard too. My dad's a pro <laughs> skater. And right as Phil, Fulfill the Dream just came out, so they're like, what? You Steve Olson's your dad? Yeah, oh, God. <laughs> right, right. I was, like, I was like, yeah. I had no idea yeah, what no. And I was like, yeah, he is. <laughs> and they're all gassed, I'm like, yeah, I'm cool. You know what I mean? I'm accepted. How amazing is that? And then I think that one day they saw him. They're like, that's not Steve Olsen. <laughs> You're like, yeah, it is. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, it is. I'm like, no, not the, short, the one with the glasses. He wasn't riding horses with everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I love that video. That was a great video, man. I always wanted to ride horses with Get him. Get him on here, please. He's somewhere in San Diego, I think, or something like oh, that. Oh, really? Same that's the stock. epically later yeah. that needs to come out. Seriously? <laughs> that, that one's good. That would be good. incredible. <laughs> oh, man. And then, it went, so you just kept skating, and then um, all your buddies kind of stopped skating we uh we were just skating around malibu and then around eighth grade i graduated and went into ninth grade yeah. and then i was just like uh, you know fu fuck school i wanted to like do skateboarding yeah and my dad was like i just i kept begging him to be like can i please be homeschooled can i i would see oh, paul right, rodriguez right. oh yeah at the courthouse on the weekends yeah and he was just like you're like that's him that's that's the guy he sponsored yeah you know aren't spanky and mm -hmm. those guys and so you know and P-Rod like, was homeschooled too he was that's uh, the thing yeah. you would hear that he's homeschooled and you're just like fuck I gotta get homeschooled right I'm gonna be like that and so you got homeschooled who was didn't, teaching didn't Steve the, was I taught myself actually he unschooled him <laughs> he, taught, yeah. he unschooled which is funny because when I heard that I was like hmm, that's, that's, just, that's not real and then like I looked it up and it's like a full real idea what ideology Unschool? unschooling unschooling, unschooling is the, the, the process of <clears throat> Uh, having the kid learn on his own and like oh. kind of very very uh, cro uh you know caveman like okay. but like you learn to deal with things at your own pace right so you would <laughs> he would bring you would bring home packets and you would just do the packets is that pretty much what it was no 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 i just had hook on phonics you just, and i was just like okay <laughs> that's it and then who would you what? okay i won't even <laughs> no no come on no, I don't but know who, who is i mean what you're turning your work into somebody right i mean a no he's just like just you you got to do it oh so you weren't even enrolled in a program oh no 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 oh this was just this literally was just like 
do yeah. you're hooked on this phonics is, yeah, and yeah. Then go Lord skate. of the Flies school. Wow. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Because when so. I picture homeschool, it's like, oh, you got to do this thing and then turn it into the school and yeah. do, you know, all that stuff. I think there was talk of doing that. Yeah. My mom was super anti homeschool. Then how did you, how did that, how did you find I think my dad just like was like, no, it's cool. It's like, <laughs> you know, like whatever, how he does it. <laughs> right. No, but maybe I think maybe she, it's like you had 10 years. Let me try my, my method. Okay. So homeschool worked out. I have no, uh, yeah. <laughs> I guess Well, I mean, so. you got to skate and fucking look what you, you, you pro skate. I mean, right, right, right. Huge career. I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. Now we got to see what happens after that. <laughs> that's that's when the school comes in. That's when the, yeah, right. Like, right. fuck. No, you're doing pretty good, man. You got a company and everything. <laughs> yeah. That, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> that's not what it's all cracked up to be. But. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll get into the I'm 917. Aware. Six nine two two seven oh six. I don't have that memorized. I had to look it's okay. at the board. It's okay. Chris, were you driving him around skating back then, or we would skate yeah. all the time? He would call me every fucking morning, and <laughs> that I was would good, come man. pick him up. Well, I, gotta, I have very fond memories. I got to tell you something because you helped me skate as well. Because at that oh, time you. too, you know, trying to go skate every day, and you know, I don't want to go skate every day and all this stuff. And so you having, still don't. I know. I still don't, but having you there to, Hey, let's go let, calling me up and stuff like that, that motivated me to get out in the streets and go and skate. And right. Right. So yeah. It was fucking rad. No, it was good. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot, there's a lot I learned. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 we can get into that. What? Leaving wax on my dashboard and having I remember it melt, that. Having, having it I, melt like, all I was like, Oh, it's going to smell really having good. Having it melt all over. Just like, <laughs> yeah. Just, <laughs> it was good. Uh, it was, it a was sh- bad. It was a shitty car. Yeah, exactly. It, was it wasn't like a Lexus. Or no, something. no, no. This is a fucking Thank 86 Toyota Corolla. <laughs> and so, yeah, growing up and then, um, what, did you get flowed by somebody else before girl? Were yeah, you? I have a, that, that was like a long fucking hike to yeah? get to that point. Who were you Fuck off, who yeah. Were you, were you getting like toy machine stuff? The story goes. Okay. I told it on the bunt though, kind of. Oh, well, Nikki nobody punched. listens to that. So <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm kidding, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, kidding, I know. we like the bunt. <laughs> long story short, I saw him, I was like, hey, let me, I want to get flowed because I like learned that word basically yeah. and what it meant. Who did you see? Mickey Reyes. Oh, Mickey Reyes. And so basically Mickey was like, whatever okay and it was the skate of the you were there you where were when there? we went up to sf yeah i mean we and olsen raided the uh, indie factory we, yeah we did all that yeah every time we would go up there he's like they fucking owe they owe they right owe. <laughs> <laughs> no i remember he'd come out with like these huge jackets with right, like, right 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 that was basically like christmas presents right, right but anyways so but later whatever we went to the skater of the year party mm-hmm. and i saw mickey and i guess mickey had been getting punched in the arm okay a couple times and I was the one person, that, the last straw, and I hit him and fucking turned around. Like, what up? Popped and, you. Yeah, and I flew in the, in the chairs. You were right there. Was I? You were with York. <laughs> and you guys were like, like, oh well, my well, God. Well, I'm not going to do anything if Mickey, I'm <laughs> sorry, bro. I get, no, 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 I get it. <laughs> I would just be like, mm, I, you probably shouldn't, you know. Right, right. I don't remember that, but uh, that sucks, dude. Uh, it and, was fine. So you. And then he was like, you're you're on the team. And like uh, went and like did. You could take a punch from him? Yeah, but that, whatever that meant. <laughs> I mean, it's a big dude. Yeah. He yeah. is a big dude. Yeah. I, maybe he turned around and he was, yeah, I don't know. I oh. wonder how that, like how his perspective was. Right. So what did you start getting? Real boards or was it? Uh... Uh, no, I never got real boards no. actually well, after that. Oh, so I mean, you I, got, the... I got like some boards from my dad, Oh, but no. So um, you weren't on the team. He lied to you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. But uh, I remember getting anti-hero boards and they had like these oh, yeah. these pirate graphics and we, okay. were, we were like, this is whack. Oh, really? <laughs> well, I mean, we just were like kids. So we're like, what? Pirates? Right, right. <laughs> and it had like a gold tooth and we're like, what the fuck? Dude, well, we don't, don't want this. We, like anti-hero. we wanted like Santa Cruz, like mini decks or something. Oh, okay. It was like cartoons and stuff. Right, right. But like that was these anti-hero and I brought it up to Jim recently. He's like, yeah, those were bad those graphics. Were bad. <laughs> <laughs> like, we, 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 the pirate theme. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I got flowed by Black Label, actually. Oh, yeah. That was my okay. first technical sponsor. And how did you get flowed by them? Did you get uh, them a tape or did you... No, was it just... never a tape. But funny enough, we, me and Kelly skated at Hubba a long time ago where I was trying to film a sponsor me tape. It was at Hubba across the street from the in and out It was on Ventura, on Ventura Boulevard? I don't know what street. I mean, it all... That, that whole yeah. place I, seems the same. Yeah. <laughs> it's like Huntington Beach. It's just like right. fucking... 
yeah, you know, yeah, Krispy sure. Kreme, In and Out, Krispy yeah. Kreme, <laughs> yeah. Walmart. Well, Kelly wasn't skating the hubba, was he? I yeah, he was be... trying. He was trying an Ollie no slide. Oh, really? Oh, I used yeah. to Sweet House was skating for a while back in the day. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, City yeah. Star days. I mean, yeah, I was on. I was just hanging with Spanky. Oh. Everyone was trying to get get theirs. So yeah. So you don't know how you got on the black label flow. You just I was uh, just from going to vans and okay. hanging around. Right. And I think uh, the team manager at the time, Tom Meow, okay, was, they knew my dad. Another oh, like, yeah. oh, you know, you're good enough to get flowed. Right. Here. Right. And then I it went on like a skate park trip mm-hmm. demo that was like really weird. But oh, really? Yeah, it was kind of cool. Did you ever feel that like maybe you're getting flowed because of your dad? No, no, that was 100. <laughs> percent I wasn't like that... I wasn't like get this motherfucker the boy right. like <laughs> right but how this shit's owed. did that make they you owe. feel a little bit <laughs> no. no 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 it wasn't it wasn't like that no i think they were just like yeah you know maybe there's some potential okay but it right. never made you feel like oh man i'm kind of oh yeah 100 oh, percent. Re- oh yeah the black label did oh okay and then uh Searle mountain lance mountain's son mm-hmm. was getting flowed on Toy Machine. Oh, okay. And I was hanging out with him a lot at the time. Gotcha. And I was like, Toy Machine's sick. I grew up watching that. Donnie yeah. Barley's part yeah. was like my favorite part. It was the first video I saw. Right. Yeah, I was like, how do, like, how do you get on? Or like, I want to I get flowed by Toy Machine. Yeah. And I did, I was, I would go to the Vans Park for some reason. I'd always try frontside inverts mm. on the like big, I don't know why. I think I was a really big fan of Tony Trujillo at the time. Okay. And I did one in front of Ed. And he's like, you're probably like the youngest person whatever in this generation do one blah 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 wow. and i think that impressed them okay so then i get flowed oh, by sick. toy machine and okay. were you were you trying to get on toy machine were you oh, trying yeah. to like film? i was like at 16 well yeah. the thing is i didn't know like how to film uh, yeah. a make a sponsor me tape okay so i was just like and i think i read a long time ago mike carroll interview or mm-hmm. in some skateboarder or just like a little quote where he's like you didn't have to send sponsor me tapes back in the day. You'd let the skating do the talking. Okay. And so I was like, I'm going to do that. Right. I'm going to go that, you know, route. Terrible route. <laughs> Ter- not, not a good <laughs> route. It's just like, you know, it's it's a long, a long road. Yeah. Well, you already had all the connections already. You just had to skate. No, that doesn't. No. I mean, yes, but no, that doesn't yeah. like, I mean, think about how many people know how many people within the industry that aren't on a, a team because of whatever. Like, look at. No offense to Lee, but why was Lee never on chocolate? You know what I mean? It's not always uh, who you know. Right, right, right. right. No, but exactly. you skate. I'm saying that you, I, dude, you, you were skating. You would skate really well. They were impressed. Yeah, somewhat. Yeah. yeah. But I, I was like, uh, he's lazy. He doesn't want to, whatever. Anyways, hold on. Go, go back. <laughs> Sorry. So Ed was like, if you really want to do this, yeah. you need to shoot photos and film. So I was like, okay. Uh, well, I've never, how do you do that? Right. You know? And like, I remember skating like, what is it? What's the rail that Heath and BA and everyone used to skate that college? UCI? The, yeah, UCI. Okay. So I remember like 5 0 in that mm. in front of them and being like, yeah, I did it. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody take your photo? No, 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 no. no, no. no. That was like not good enough. No. But then. Uh, Sounds good to me. Shit. <laughs> that was the six day rail. It was, <laughs> I, that's I, a great I, rail. Yeah. I would love to see you try I'd that. I'd be stoked to do that. Yeah, Ed kind of took me under his wing and taught me like, oh, this is how mm-hmm. the industry kind of works. Okay. You know, you got to do this and that. Your dad never tell you that? No, he like had a skewed view on it. <laughs> you know, he's like, fuck these motherfuckers. <laughs> they owe. They owe. They'll they rip owe. you off. And that like, be he a shirt. Had, they owe. They owe. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he, yeah. Anyways, we don't even need to get, he wants to start a company again. So. Oh, does he? Oh, we yeah. Gotta I was like, back mm, on the show. You're, you're too old, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, your time has come and passed. It's gone. Well, he's also like, I want to bring back. I'm like, don't, it went out for a reason. Like, don't bring it back. <laughs> You never had a chance. Fuck uh, you. Yeah, I was like, no. If you're gonna do something, at least do something new. Don't. Okay. Don't like bring back something. SOS. That's reha- yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh. So I was just like, don't do it. Okay. Like, same old why? Yeah, yeah uh, it meant surf or skate, or oh, Steve did Olson. It? But he says, I think it meant Steve, Steve Olson, Olson. But, yeah. but uh, yeah. he says surf or skate. So yeah, Ed. I mean, I remember you were telling me like, yeah, if you you know keep skating you you know you get you could get on girl which yeah. i was like there's no way those guys are at the you know right the top. i don't even skate like that i like i can't like whatever yeah i was i was like not interested in that skating at the time okay. I, I really liked it but yeah i wanted to like you wanted to go in a different direction <laughs> just different anti-hero st- and yeah. all those that that stuff was like this is cool right you know what i mean even with the pirate graphics after the pirate graphics <laughs> you know i think uh trujillo grew out his hair and wasn't like the like 
Okay. I mean, he was a like prank rock kid, but like he was more like the Motley Crue. Right, right. And he was like, oh, this guy's cool. Who, who the fuck is this guy? You know, <laughs> I want to hang out with this guy. Yeah. Yeah, so there was that, and then it transferred to to- Black Label to Toy Machine. Mm-hmm. And I was like, not released. I was like... Did you have to quit Black Label? Y- yeah, it was like, it sucked. <laughs> what do you mean? Did you call? Who did you I call? I called Tom, and I was like, hey, so like Toy Machine offered me boards, and I really, really would like to pursue that you quit whatever. flow i quit flow yeah, yeah exactly you quit <laughs> flow. like i've quit flow a lot of times lot, yeah <laughs> but uh so we went on a uh toy machine road trip okay. around america which was like the most insane like 16 hour drives after a demo like ed didn't set up that trip for some reason uh-huh. someone at the office of tomietto was like oh okay we'll just do it like this and didn't like realize from like Oh, whatever texas to right to like wherever else <clears throat> basically the east coast is <laughs> fucking a long drive yeah. right <laughs> and so <clears throat> yeah there was just like these grueling. 18 yeah 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 yeah. Right. Well, and that was my first like u.s trip but even though it was grueling were you still hyped to be i mean you, like, you're at yeah. 16 you're like right what's grueling at 16 i mean, I mean it was just still, like this is long right you know what i mean that's like not that bad Are we there yet yeah exactly <laughs> yeah and then I, I remember seeing like johnny layton's like sponsor me tape oh, and be yeah. like oh this is how good you have to actually be oh. <laughs> like mm, not making this one no 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 i was like yeah i was like fuck this guy <laughs> i mean you know you're just like fuck this guy's gonna take me out right i can't do anything about it i'm just not good enough right but i remember just like just being like kind of bummed because yeah. it was like johnny got on and i was just like i'm not getting on, like, oh. come on. And, and i think i was really hyped because like caswell berry was on this is like the oh, new yeah. toy machine those like brian and like the classic toy machine had you know the party yeah right. right so it was caswell and like billy marks and stuff which i was really excited like yeah still a sick team what are you, what are you, <laughs> <laughs> are you looking no at comment. me like that <laughs> <laughs> but uh anyways uh, moving right along yes please it yes. happened for a reason okay and yeah i think i was like I want, like the mosaic video had just come out uh, i was like yeah. i want to get on alien right like fuck i can't get on this i want to get flowed by alien okay and also, I was skating actually with Spanky and Herman and Leo. Okay. And I remember those dudes were just, the way they approached skating, mm-hmm. I, I couldn't do it that way. And I would always be so frustrated, like, I can't skate rails like this. Oh. Like, I just don't have that commitment like that. And I think I went on a trip with Ellington to San Francisco, and okay. I remember seeing Reese Forbes. And I remember seeing Huff. And yeah. I'd be like, dude, that guy's sick. Yeah. Like, I love, like, when there was, uh, what were they filming? They were filming Real to Real, for oh, Real to Real. Okay. And I remember seeing Reese Forbes on that San Francisco trip, and he was just charging and yeah. skating ledges, like, really fast, which I had never seen. Okay. Really tall ledges, probably, too? Right, exactly. Yeah. And he, like, had a golf glove on, and, like, lo- <laughs> like, 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 he had, like, the, the opposite mm-hmm. of the piss drunks, but, like, had, like, you know. Super clean. Super clean, yeah. but, like, you know, had whatever it had something going on yeah. i don't want to say swag because that's power behind the skating yeah i was like wow this guy's sick yeah. and i remember like ellington kind of being like like kind of taken back but maybe not i don't know oh, okay. but like he was just skating really good and he was just like nike had just started and mm. he just looked really clean right and scott johnston was my favorite skater oh it's a lot of people's favorite skater right right my right favorite skater too but when we would go to the park i remember oh, yeah. being like whoa that's like i mean he was, they was right as modus operandi had come oh, okay. out so they those guys were on it fire, yeah. yeah and scott and he would was just flow right right so right nice. i had never seen yeah. someone skate with like speed and like that you Grace know what i mean and, right yeah. right right i mean i had seen hasoi skate like that mm-hmm. when i was really young right. but it was most like you know rail skaters yeah. and like guys that huck down stuff right with, right you know speed and all that stuff mm-hmm. you don't see really yeah learning that and being like oh wow being influenced by that Mm -hmm. i i realized like i can't skate like leo or i can't skate like herman or anything like i just don't i don't have the timing and these were the dudes you were skating with i mean you know like how there's like circles and outer circles of friends that like clicks like in you know go in and out of right i was like one of those like you know passing chips i guess that was hanging out (laughs) with them you know what i mean they were like the baker crew and like whatever you know i think this this is skateboarding had just come out and spanky's part of that was amazing right right he was like the guy at yeah. that point and like i was like fuck man 
like I was skating with him a lot and I just I mean that's when me and Kelly skated that hubba I remember and mm -hmm. like trying to skate that hubba and I, I, whatever he, they were filming for it and like Whoa. again like I said like we were trying to like all get our own did you get the clip on the hubba yeah you and got then, it did the funny Kelly thing is I don't know no. I'm sorry I, I don't I don't think that. you did uh, <laughs> 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 I, don't, but I really I don't think yeah I think you were like fucking fuck pissed. Oh, pissed. I mean I can I, yeah <laughs> yeah I got it and then I remember being like hey scuba can I get that tape Oh. And just like back then, you couldn't obviously. It was just, like, you had to get a tape okay. and yeah. like get all Fire that. Wire it over, yeah. Yeah, not even. I think I was like, I, yeah, I didn't know how to do that. So I was, I was like trying to like make a sponsor me tape, but it was just like, fuck this. You know, it's like a this lot is. Of work, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like you got to yeah. be motivated. For sure. MySpace had just come out, and I remember hitting up Jason Dill. Jason Dill. Oh, and I was sick. Like, On MySpace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because oh. I was like, oh, he's my favorite. Right. You know, and I was like, hey whatever uh, i would love to come to new york i don't know what the hell i was thinking like, <laughs> uh, just like hey and he's like all right come on no I'll way get you a ticket he would get, get you a ticket. ticket i got me a ticket yeah out of no wow. yeah i mean he's really generous in, yeah, the, in that I've, sense I've heard, like yeah. that he got me a ticket and i went out wow. to stay with him in new york or i think i said like i always wanted to come out to new york and just by myself okay you know right and he was like, all right. Sick. So you went out there. Did you oh. already know him at all? Or? No, I, I didn't know him at so all. So MySpace. Wow. Wow. MySpace. Were Cold you even serious? Yeah, were you even <laughs> friends? Cold exactly. Was Cold he in Cold. your top eight at least on MySpace? <laughs> that or? wasn't no, around wasn't yet. It? Oh, okay. <laughs> it was just me and Tom. You and Tom. <laughs> and my, yeah, and I remember like, I don't have an ID. My dad's like, well, uh, let's go to a check cashing place. And I got on the plane with, you know, like a, a laminated no thing way. with my like name signature. Crazy. Try that now. I know. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> So you went and stayed with Dill? Yeah. How was that? That was uh, that was a great, amazing time, you yeah. know? But the funny thing is that I was like, oh my, uh, I can't wait. Like, I want, I've never seen this guy skate in person. Right. Photosynthesis, crazy hair, cool style. I can't wait. Yeah. And then he had like a shaved head and he'd just been like, party Dill. <laughs> oh, shit. And I was just like, all right, whatever. Like, he'll come out skating. And like, it just never. Never happened. Like he did, but like, it was just like, I never got to see like, Dill time. Dill, right. Yeah, I didn't get to see him like, huh. yeah. So we, would you just go out by yourself? Like, I, want, like, I wanted to see like how I saw Scott or Carol yeah. or any of those guys like go off. Right. I was like waiting for the Dill. Moment. Yeah, I just never, never came. came. Oh, I was shit. like heartbroken. Yeah. <laughs> how like, long did you stay out there with him? Three months. Three oh, months? Really? Right. Well, yeah. one all the whole, I, I stayed out there for three months. I didn't okay. stay only at his place. Uh, I made friends and started like crashing, gotcha. you know, doing the tour. Right, couch tour. Were you getting alien boards at this point or? No, 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 no. Really? So I was actually getting foundation boards Oh. because I was hanging out with like the Hell Rose. You the really did so move, you move around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got it, man. You got it. You got to get in where you fit in. You went toy machine to foundation? It was kind of weird where like toy machine just, I just, it was just like, you just know, yeah, I just was like, there's no way. There's all, there's no room. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? I think like, no offense to Yaji, but like, I think he had that same moment of oh, like, okay. all right, Elijah, Raven, mm, Stevie. Right. And he's like, dude, these guys are good. Like, yeah. I'm not huh. at par with them. Okay. So it was like that same type of moment of clarity, I guess. So, okay. So then I was hanging out with Jason Hernandez and mm. Daniel Shimizu. Okay. From like hanging out with the Spanky crew and all that. Right. And like kind of, I don't know how I started hanging out with Daniel. Hmm. But I started staying at his place a lot. In L.A. or New York? No, in, in L.A. This oh, okay. is before Dill. Yeah. I'm, I'm, oh, going, before. I'm backtracking, gotcha. sorry. Okay. And so I was hanging out with just that crew for, fuck, for what? I'm just trying to think because I was hanging out with like Lance Dawes uh -huh. and Abe a lot. No, no, no. This isn't right. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, that's all right. I was hanging out with Lance Dawes a lot. Okay. And I think I went on a trip, an Etnies trip, because he was like the staff photographer for Etnies at the time. Hmm. And Dave Wang was the f oh, yeah. the filmer okay. for Etnies, and this is right when they had like Zared Bassett, Billy Marks, you know Josh Harmony, and all that, and yeah. they just made the that team or whatever the new AM team, and uh -huh. it was like Etnies kind of like revamped their program. Right. And so I went on an Etnies trip with them, but I was flowed by America, or I was just like, whatever, just like you got, I'll wear them. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know. But uh, yeah, so I went on that trip. I, I think I just like met and hung out with like the foundation team at okay. that time. And then Josh Beagle was just nice and like, 
I'll send you boards, no problem. Wow, he's a good filmer, by the way. Not that one. Oh, <laughs> different people. Oh, different. Oh, okay. Got me. I was like, what? Was this guy fucking serious? So, okay, I'm sorry. No, um, no, no. Yeah, so I was getting foundation boards mm-hmm. when I went out to New York. Okay. And I remember hanging out with Dill, and we were watching like an E! travel show or whatever with... with with Brooke Burke? Yeah, with Brooke Burke. And they were at the Playboy Mansion. <laughs> right. I remember and, that. Yeah, for, right, right, right. I forgot about all that. And whatever. Yeah. And then we're watching it. And Wild like, on E. Wild on E. Uh, <laughs> Wild on E. And yeah. then he's on the phone with Chris Carter talking like, blah, blah, blah. And then I was watching it. I'm like, hey, that's Dave Duncan in the pool. <laughs> and he's like, oh, my God, it is. What? That's fucking hilarious. He's like, Alex, who do you get boards from? I'm like, Foundation. I was like, he's gonna ask, he's gonna yeah. ask. <laughs> <laughs> and so I was like, yeah. And he's like, do you wanna get boards from Alien? I was like, yes. Yeah, and that was getting... a, yeah just from identifying Dave, Dave Duncan. <laughs> Zero skills involved. And I think we went on a trip and we skated with Danny, Danny Renaud. Oh, well, sick. And I was like, whoa, this guy's, he's super intimidating. He was an asshole yeah. at that time. Right, right. He was and, an incredible skateboarder. And like, Seriously. yeah, so, and he was just like not happy. He was like, whatever, kid. And we're, I think we were the same age, but he was like an adult. And right. I was just like, yeah, yeah. haven't hit puberty still. <laughs> but uh, that happened and we went on a trip and I was like, fuck, these guys are really good. I gotta like get technical. I can't skate this stuff. Oh, how that trip started was actually, we were watching Tent City. Mm-hmm. And Dill was like, I want to go on a skate park trip. I want to film skate park tricks. And no I'm like, way. Okay. <laughs> I, I mean, I was like, okay, down. Yeah. Like, let's go. And <laughs> he's like, all right, we're going to go here, 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 here. And I remember he got one trick and it was like this, like, <laughs> it was in a slap. I don't know. It's in some t- one slap. And it was like this sketchy, like little bank to like, you know, the, the, the crater of the backside of the bowl. And okay. they did this wall, right? And I was just like, there's no, f- oh no. It was a little bank to a wall to then like into this crater. And I was just like, there's no fucking way this guy's going to make this trick. He's on acid if he thinks he's doing this. <laughs> and like fucking three tries later, he's fucking rolling away. Like, the, the, you know, like yeah. fucking like, you know, doing that. Or I was like, what? How the fuck did he just do that? Yeah. Like, there's no way. It was, and that was his only trick that he got the whole time? Once he got that, it was fucking hats was, off party time. Oh, you know what I mean? It. Or shirts off, whatever you want to call it. It was just like, <laughs> you know what I mean? He's like, I got a trick. Yeah. And just like, he, it, it was good. And the rest of the tour. Because he was like the motivator of the trip. So oh. like, once he got a trick, he was fine. Like, the article was finished for him. <laughs> right. And they could have ran it just a one, one, one page, page article. Yeah. yeah. Did you get a uh, photo in the article? Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And then, whatever, I went back to L.A. Mm-hmm. And then started skating and trying to shoot more photos from, like, what Ed taught me and all that. I, the Supreme Bowl had just opened up. Okay. And so, Carol and Scott and all these guys started showing up and skating the bowl. And then my friends worked there, so I was just hanging out and yeah. I'd skate with them. And I remember th- this spot right here was like oh, I, the f- oh, yeah. the fence. The so, at Fairfax High? Fairfax High. Uh-huh. I did that. I didn't know I was getting the cover or anything. I was right. like, oh, you could do this, whatever, grind. And I remember getting that and being like, yes, I'm. I'm getting on this fucking team now <laughs> for sure. There's no fucking way I'm not. Alien or girl? No, alien. Alien. Good okay. Girl hadn't happened yet. No. Who took that photo, by the way? Ben. 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 Okay. And I was like, yes, finally. <laughs> right. I fucking, the wait is over. <laughs> you know? And I remember the team managers being like, yeah, cool, cool cover. He had a really deep voice. And he's okay. like, yeah, cool cover. Right. I was like, okay, yeah, cool. And I hung up and I was like, that. That's it. <laughs> That's it. And Tyler got on instead. Oh, oh shit. wow! But I mean, this was this was like hot clothing, Tyler. So I was yeah. just like, "What? Are you <laughs> fucking kidding me? I lost from like I lost to a termite kid. You gotta be fu- like, come on, what do I gotta do? I got a cover, right? You know? I was just like, it's not happening, man. It's just not gonna happen. So girl was the last resort. Uh, that was the <laughs> no, last no, 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 not at all. No. So I was just like. And I was trying to film with Greg, and I was trying to film with for the Alien video. Okay. And that was really early on. And I just remember being like, I'm not into, like, how strict this is. And we'd go on trips and, like, whatever. It was just, like, it just was super militant. And I was just like, this isn't fun. 
Right. And, and again, like girl is just like, there's no way they're the, the top, you know, still try, still think they're just that, like, yeah. no, there's no way. Okay. I was like trying to get on Ruby at one point. Oh, the, yeah. <laughs> Megan's right. Cause I was like, right. Right. yeah, I was just like, oh, if I can get on this. <laughs> yeah. Once I'm, I'm in the building. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so just trying to get foot in the door. Yeah. So, yeah. So then I think I was just like, I, I, I had a bike and it got stolen mm. and I was just like bummed. And I, I remember writing Greg, like, I don't think this is going to like work whatever i'm just like this oh. I'm, I'm not into it Greg Hunt? yeah which i don't know why i sent it to him <laughs> but he was just like the the guy in charge over that, that the, whole alien thing but he wasn't he was just yeah. the filmer no but you but were you know, over I, the whole alien thing you i were, was just like again it's not gonna happen like they just put the new kid on right I, like and, and i'm like i don't know why this this time I, it was like cover all this uh, stuff and, right I, was, I mean i didn't have that much coverage but i was just like I, well, come on plus you're out skating with dill and the whole you know like going on these trips right 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 so, so i was just like oh yeah. all right oh anyways and i was just like i'm like was kind of like i maybe i'm just gonna quit uh, you know I'm like skating altogether. well you, you just like you try yeah, and try and yeah. it's like i don't know it's like not becoming fun right. and yeah. I, I remember when we were skating back in the day we would go skate with men england do you remember right. Elisa Oviejo would go over there and right, then right, Greg right. would pick us up we all go skate right, right, we right. skated that bump over table in uh, Long Beach yeah 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. the day that Carol like pressure flipped it or something like that right right right, right. I just remember that day because I remember I got I broke my foot right after that but oh. I remember you meeting I was kind of right when you started skating with Carol and Rick right and then the next thing I saw that like they, you guys were skating together and the next right. thing you know I heard he was on girl mm. right it was like it seemed like you just kind of gravitated towards those guys yeah it was it was more just scott you know from going to supreme and scott kind of had a, a connection with supreme from new york and he lived in new york and moved back to la and mm -hmm. all that and so uh he yeah we were just skating the bowl and then he was just like oh you want to go street skate sometime yeah i was like okay yeah and then we just started slowly hanging out and going street skating and yeah and then like I th oh, I was still getting alien boards. And then I remember this is was happening. And then he was like, D who do you get shoes from? I'm like, oh, uh, and I remember I would like skate Anthony's Nikes because he was on DC and he had like a shoe collection. Oh, Ooh. shit. Yeah. And that's what those are were. Oh, okay. And I remember being like, oh, let me skate these. Because I was like, I, like you know, I don't know. I feel like shoe, like that whole shoe thing wasn't what it is now. But right. it was like those guys were into it. Yeah. And it was like this kind of weird thing where they would go to Japan and get these like weird colors and yeah. mm -hmm. all that. So, um, but Scott was like, you you know, like you could get on Makai if you wanted to. And I was like, oh, get on. on. Yeah. Well, he said, I was like, mm -hmm. yeah. it's time, bitch. <laughs> get your foot in the door now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. like, but you know, it did, that wasn't how it went i thought it was like you're on right you know like cut the ribbon yeah fucking, you know <laughs> confetti yeah exactly yeah. none of that so we were skating a lot i started getting lakai shoes and then i remember going to to um what's the huntington beach thing that they have every year and converse used to sponsor the u.s it. open the u.s yeah. open mm. so i remember girl had like a signing and i just tagged along and i had just quit or whatever quick flow for alien okay. And, our, and Guy had just started coming around again. Oh. And like, he just had that big interview with everything and it was like really exciting. Right. Yeah, and uh, I remember skating with him and I remember he's like, who do you get boards from? I'm like, oh, I used to get boards from Alien, but I don't get boards from them. And he's like, you wanna get girl boards? And I was like, ah! <laughs> Guy <laughs> said that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I was it's like, amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you know? I love the question, who do you get boards from? Right, that right, seems right. to be the question. <laughs> right, right. But like, was here like, it the comes. Fuck? Yeah, right. exactly. But that was like fucking uh, American Idol moment of like, <laughs> you're going to make it to the next round. <laughs> you know, where your fucking girl's crying. <laughs> right, yeah. So you Come out with the number. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The card, parents yeah. are cheering. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, but uh, so, yeah, so that happened. And uh, yeah, I was like, gas. I was like, yeah, okay, sick. Yeah. And then I went on a trip with, with those guys. Okay. And it was for a fully flared, but I didn't know, I think they were just like, come on the trip. Like, oh, you sick. know, I, I wasn't like, like yeah, I have to fucking film, I, but like, I was just like, let's get tricks. You were going for it. Right, and I think right. I got the most tricks on the trip. Wow. Yeah, exactly. Good. <laughs> I bet the older dudes were pissed. <laughs> no, I, they're probably, you know, like, I, I made an impression. Kidding. No, no, I know, I know. But, uh, so yeah, that happened and, and then it was like, oh, you're gonna get an ad. 
And then I got my ad. Wow. What was my ad? Oh, no, no, no. I didn't get on Lakai first. I got on Girl before oh. I got on Lakai. Okay. But How they, did they say that you were on Girl? Did they just say, did they just say, oh, you're on? I'm, 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 that part is a weird blur because huh. I want to say that I started getting a check from Lakai before Girl, but they had to put me on Girl first. Right. To like make it. I don't know. Well, the one to exactly, well, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so shoes, right? Yeah, for, for whatever reason. So I remember my f- getting on girl. And I remember they're like, "All right, we need an ad from you." I'm like, "Okay," and I was like, "Fuck, I don't know what to do." And they're like, "Hey, like, you know, you got like two more days." Oh, oh wow! And I remember going party. Like I went and partied and like made out with this girl, mm-hmm. and I was like, "Fuck well, yeah!" <laughs> and then fucking, and then fucking. That morning, I was like kind of hungover. I'm like, fuck, I need to get an ad. Yeah. And I got the ad and I was like, party time. Party Let's time go. Again. Where's that girl again? Right. Yeah. And I was like trying to, yeah. Trying to celebrate. What, what was the ad? Do you remember? And it was a kickflip over that, that, um, a bump to rail over on La Cienega, like Kareem and like, uh, Gino switch flips it and chocolate oh, to her. That's right. That's right. That was okay. the first one. Right. And I remember photoshopping a dog in it. I'm oh, like, can you, can you guys just put this in for whatever? I don't know why. No way. <laughs> yeah, there's like a dog that like is in the sequence for, oh, this is why, because Beeble had an ad with a mouse that was Photoshopped in it. Oh. And I was like, oh, that's so, that's so cool. Mm-hmm. I want like a dog. How come I don't even remember these at photoshopped animals? I don't because know. it was like good enough where you wouldn't you like, wouldn't it was like kind of weird. It was just like, <laughs> just a dog. Like it came, it, and it was a sequence. So it came into frame and like stayed and then like came out of frame. I gotta go check that out again. That's interesting. Yeah, it's That's good. Crazy. It was like just a Labrador just sitting next yeah. to the fucking, <laughs> the spot. How long were you on Girl for? Hold on. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, go back. Okay. No, no, but I mean, we were just getting on Lakai. Oh, okay. Okay. And so we filmed all that, did the video. How was filming the the little like your explosion wasn't as big as the other guys' explosion? No, no, no. I didn't know? get. I got more electricity. Yeah. yeah How was static. that? Did you do that first try or? I think so. Yeah. Oh. Well, it was like Alex. We only get one shot at this. Okay. <laughs> and so I was like, <laughs> right, let, it. Oh, it was like, let me try it. Yeah. And then like we're gonna shoot it. Okay. I was like, all right. And it wasn't like when it happened, like. By the time you're landing on it, mm-hmm. you're like riding off, and it's like doing its, doing its thing. Right, like right. Mo, Mike Mo was like, I obviously couldn't. I don't even know how you would fucking be able to do that. Right? Yeah, could have died during that. <laughs> right, yeah. and it's just like, yeah. So that was cool, though. The whole fully flat. It was huge yeah. video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, and that was like, they had been filming for it already, mm-hmm. and it was like. I think they were like three years in and then I got in and it was like two and a half years. Oh, okay. So it was like a, yeah, five and a half year video. Right. You had to catch up. I didn't have to catch up, but they just kept putting people on. Yeah. <laughs> they put Eric on. Oh, that's right, Guy. I think, and they put Guy on. Yeah. So then it was just like, we got to have these guys have full parts and Ty wanted it to be, you know, the Ty Evan experience. Right. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They, everyone calls it the Kai curse or the intro yeah. curse or whatever, but like, I mean, he was on his his thing. Yeah. I mean, that that was Spike, but you know, whatever, everything else. Right. I think it was just like those big videos take a lot of energy, and you know, my hat goes off to him for being motivated every time to go through that and like have the you know the focus for five years. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like and not like get burnouts. You know. Right. And he, he's done it a, a lot of times. Yeah. You know, and he's still Seriously. doing it. Did were you getting? Did you get burnt out on some of those trips and stuff? Because I heard they were gnarly. They were gnarly trips. The, the first one where like I got the most footage, blah blah blah. Um, that one was like, and that was like a, just an intense trip. Okay. I now look back on it, and it's like, oh man, that was so much fun. Right. But during, not so much fun. <laughs> not, not, not fun. Like it was just like, can we stop for water? And he was just like just driving <laughs> and like we're like dude no we're, we're dude we're hungry and he's just like <laughs> just like all right but he's got the eye he's got his eye on the next right, right, city right right, right. he's spot. yeah exactly like, he's, he's got the shot set up already first yeah you know but uh, 300 miles out yeah exactly <laughs> yeah, i'm coming right. yeah the first trip was like oh that was fun but like that was really gnarly yeah and it was like an, the second part of that and that was like fun but then gnarly but i think i had just gotten on quicksilver at that point oh okay I mean, it just got really intense mm. at the end. You know what I mean? And like, yeah. were you over it at, by by the end, or were you? Uh... I think it just got to a point where I was like, "All right, 
Yeah. I mean, like, Ty was starting to call me. I was answering his calls. Oh, really? Yeah. But then I started going into, like, little kid mode where I was just like, I don't want it to be like, I want it to be like this. And I remember, I think it was like, this is the song I want to skate to. And he's like, it, it, whatever, it doesn't have enough changes. Oh. Which I, and then I listened to it today. I'm like, what? It has enough changes. What are you fucking oh, talking really? about? <laughs> you just didn't like it. Was, was like, that your choice to skate to that? Was it King Diamond that you skated to? I mean, that was like the like sixth choice oh, out man. of like all the other songs I wanted. And I, he just liked that one for some reason. Oh. And I was just... I'm but sure it, it came down to like getting music rights too. If the, the band I think that I wanted... To sk- my original first song was Public Image by Public Image. Oh. And and uh, whatever. I just... It wasn't enough emotion for him. But uh, for what I get it, you know, picking songs, I, we just had to do it. So right. it's fucking a nightmare. Were you happy with the, your your part and everything and the song and at the end or were? Uh, yeah, I mean, I just remember like the titles coming up and just sinking into my chair, like oh at fuck the, <laughs> at the premiere. Yeah, yeah. just like well, you know, well because that, that was the first this big, that was basically. like the first video that you were in, right? And yeah, with I was the, just in, like, a, in a premiere oh, setting and everything. Yeah, it was fucked. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's cool. I, I was like, I remember that feeling. I. I don't think I ever really got that feeling again after oh, that. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was a big, prim- uh, 1,800 was like, people or something. Right, exactly. Right. Huge. Royce Hall, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then we went on the little world tour and all that. Yeah, dude. I That's remember, rad, though. That was cool. Yeah. I remember being in Canada and like, there are, it's like some kids like, Olsen, you better not suck. No way. <laughs> I was just like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember like if you were getting different reactions in different cities or was it pretty much all the same? I remember in Canada, like the what frontside people, like well, Revert, mm-hmm. like kids in Canada, like, what the fuck? Oh, really? I was like, okay, that's cool. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> you know? Yeah. But uh, I remember hearing Spanky talking about like, or John Minor talking about like, how certain things when they were, went on their trip okay. this was like years before uh. how like kids re- would react to different stuff yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, it's interesting yeah I remember in Pretty Sweet we they played it in New York and no one cheered really and yeah, I, remember, right. I remember Rick going like tough crowd <laughs> <laughs> uh, after Fully Flared then that was when like you know other sponsors started coming at you yeah you know and everyone else Right. You kn- so video. you noticed a difference after that video. Well, I remember Gravis was starting, and and I was skating for Quicksilver, and Oblo was gonna start Gravis. Oh. And they're like, we're gonna start Gravis. I'm like, Pff, that is whack. I'm <laughs> in the fucking paycheck. I was like, okay, <laughs> fuck, I'll wear that G. <laughs> yeah. But anyways, I mean, it was just like I can't say no to that. Yeah. You know what I mean? It was just like they're throwing crazy money aw- around. Oh really? And I remember going to Rick and Mike being like. I, I don't want to do this, but this is like life changing. Right. You know what I mean? Like, they were hurt. You oh, yeah. know what I mean? Right. I, and I didn't, I was like, what do you want me to do? Well, at least you had an honest conversation with them. R- yeah. Right. But then I was thinking, like, but I'm still on Girl and, you know, like, I get to go with different crews yeah. and thinking that was really cool. And he's just like, and they didn't really get it. Yeah. Which I, as, as I got older, I completely understand mm-hmm. why. Mm-hmm. But, uh, and then Van, then I, I showed it to Robin, who worked at Vans, because I had known her because she worked at Baker. And I was just like, I don't know contracts. Can you look at this? And oh. she was looking at it, and she's like, well, why don't I just make you an offer from no Vans? No way. Oh, shit. And I was going like, to say, because I don't even, I was like, Gravis? I don't even remember you on Gravis. No, no, no. no. She yeah. was like, why don't I just make you an offer? And I was like, okay. And she, you know, wrote something up, wrote something up and was like, here, and like, you know whatever and mike and them like all right we're gonna see if we can match it i was like all right cool wow was that vans offer bigger than the gravis one no it was a little oh so then it was gravis and then nike came in and then it was yeah (laughs) Yeah. okay the bid the bid the bids were up right (laughs) i mean which which is not good no no it's like yeah you're getting validation for sure right you're like yeah it's cool what you've been looking for the whole all this whole time (laughs) it finally (laughs) happened and you didn't want it but anyway so that happened and I think I was like Nike was offering a lot of money okay. and then I was like, oh, all right, Vans. I'm like, I get a pro shoe on Vans mm. if I do it. And I think at that time, I remember talking to Lance Mountain about it. I'm like, what should I do? Yeah. And he was just I was like, a pro shoe doesn't mean like, it might be nice, but like just take the money and then the, like the oh. money is what you want. Okay. Like the, if your shoe doesn't do good, you don't make that's as true, much. right? Right. So he was just like kind of advising me on that. Wow. 
I didn't take his advice. No. <laughs> I, I wanted that pro shoe. You wanted that, okay. But, uh, and I remember like, I don't know where, but I remember Danny Garcia, oh, because he was on Quicksilver. He's like, having a pro shoe isn't all what it's cracked up to be. Oh, so you're hearing it from different people. Well, yeah, but I'm hearing like, it's not that cool to have yeah. a pro shoe. It's more work. Well, kind of. They're like, it's a lot more work than you think. Like, it's not us having a shoe and like yeah. that, you know. Um, So... But then I was like, well, I want, like, I really want to design a shoe. I have, like, ideas, blah, blah, blah. And so I went with Vans. Okay. And that was, that was cool. And Ava was on Vans. I was like, you know, one of my favorite skaters yeah. growing up. And I was just like, yeah, cool. Like, I'm skating with Ava and yeah. Andrew Allen and, you know, Jeff Rowley and all these guys. Oh, and Dylan. Dylan was on Vans. Oh, there you and go. that's why I was like, like, I want to get on, you know, hang out with Dylan. Yeah. And so he left of Gravis. I was like, all right, whatever. I got Abe and these other guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then it was just like shortly after, I was like, I don't, you don't have that same connection of friendship that I was on Lakai. Oh. But I didn't get, like, I just was too young to know, like, understand, yeah. mm -hmm. like, having that connection and like having shared jokes and all that stuff. Right. Okay. You know, I, was, I had to, like, you know, you had to go out to see and come back and be like, oh. So how long did the van sing last though? Three, three, three years? four years. Okay. Oh. Yeah. And, uh, no shoe. Did you get a shoe? So it was in the contract and I got this like weird, like, you know how they like do like the sneaky, like designed by, they don't oh. give you like the, the full credit, right, yeah. gotcha. which was fine. But I remember designing it and being like, I want it to look like there was these like fashion shoes called, um, common projects. Mm -hmm. And so I was like taking it up. I'm like, this would look really cool if you made it a Vans. Oh, and it was called the Versa. Yeah, and it just didn't look that cool. No, you weren't? Well, I was like, they weren't listening. I was like, all right, take all the padding out. Like, it, it, why does it need padding? I, my foot's just gonna get hot. Like, oh. and so, they're, they're like, no, 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 we need it for sales, that whole mm, song and dance. Gotcha. They had to do it, and Vans had just left a bad taste in my mouth. I was trying to move to New York, uh -huh. cause I was like, oh, I wanna move here. I like skating out here, the way it, whatever functions. Right. And they're like, no, if you move, we'll kick you off. Really? Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So wow. I was like, then that just made me like, okay, fuck you guys. Whoa. And I was just like, I don't, yeah, whatever. So I was just like not into Vans at so that you, time. So you, uh, was Robin still working there when? She had just gotten fired or let go or I, I don't know what happened with her situation, but. Uh, Crazy. Yeah, so it was just like, there was that moment, which is a really good moment actually. But, uh, you know, I, I think I would w went on a trip I was just like, it was in Arizona and just wasn't feeling it. I was like, all right, I'll get a skate trick. And I remember Abe getting really, I was, I, I was like, all right, I'll just go get this trick and whatever. I'll, I got my trick for the article. Okay. And he was so pissed at like, he was like, what? I can't believe you're fucking thinking like that. Like yelling at me. I was like, whoa, this is definitely not cool. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. And then, uh, yeah, I just was like, all right, I'm over this. I'm like, I was like over skating. I was like, I want to be a fashion photographer. They make fucking money and Wait, hang out with hot chicks. Yeah, yeah. Well, that sounds, sounds good. I don't need to get yelled at. Yeah. Yeah, I just, my, my, my heart wasn't in it at that point. Okay. I just, like, you know, fully flared, had like, you know, I was just like burnt out from this like. And you shoot for pretty sweet too at the time. That had, that, this was right in the between of that. So they were thinking about doing a Vans video and like there was all this talk and yeah, it was just like, uh, you know, a weird, like I was going out to New York a lot and filming with Bill and he was making those little black and white edits. Mm -hmm. And then he was getting brought on to do a Quicksilver video. And then Rick and Mike were talking about doing a chocolate video and it just turned into pretty sweet. Right. But, you know, it, it was just like, I, like again, like I said, my heart wasn't, yeah. I was just like done with skating at that moment. So did you quit bands? No, but I was just over it. I was just oh, like, yeah. dude, get me the fuck out of here. And yeah. I remember Hunter calling me. I was like, hey, what's over here? Oh, and I got, a, and so then they started, they gave me a pro shoe, but okay. Dylan had just come out with his pro shoe. On Gravis. Gravis. Yeah. And that was like that dress shoe. Mm -hmm. And like, I was skating a dress shoe that l didn't look like his shoe, but it was like kind of similar. Mm. And I was like, I kind of want this to be my shoe. Mm-hmm. And they're like, yeah, that's the, you know, that's like whatever the, like the high end vert, whatever. They have like all these different tiers. Tier, okay. Like the vault series. The vault, thank yeah, you. Yeah. I was, I was, yeah. So it was the vault series and like, yeah, that's like, it won't work. And I was just like, how is that not going to work? I'm taking a design from Vans, designing a shoe, you know, inspired by Vans to like be, be like the second whatever design of it. 
and how are you telling me that's not gonna work yeah whatever anyways long story short they like gave me basically dylan's shoe i was like i don't this is no i don't want this wow you know like this isn't i'd rather just not have a shoe no but this is what's selling right now basically yeah and like you're you're of the like like-minded person crazy well whatever and i just i still have the shoe Oh yeah, yeah. I want to sell on eBay because I'm like, what the fuck am I gonna do with this thing? Right. I don't want to fucking. I'm just like, There's I only look one. at it. Yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be on eBay soon. So okay. fucking keep. We'll put the yeah. Fuck. Who, he's starting at fucking one dollar bid. <laughs> I buy now. Yeah. So, anyways, that all happened, and that was just like kind of wasn't that that great of an experience. Even though gotcha. it was a good experience, it just wasn't what I was looking for. Right. Right. So I remember them sending me my contract and I, I had it in the back of my car for like months and I didn't sign it. Vans? Vans. Okay. And I, I was making money from Quicksilver. So I just, I, I was like floating by and okay. I wasn't like dependent on that. Right. For whatever fucking reason. I was like, whatever, I'll sign it and they'll, I'll get back pay. Oh. I just had, had, didn't do it. Okay. And I remember Hunter calling me up and they're like, hey, what's up with your uh, Vans contract? And I was like, oh, I haven't signed it. Like, well, do you want to get on Nike? Wow. And Damn. I was like, get me the fuck out of here. Cole, <laughs> Cole I mean, called I, you. I don't know how, they were just starting a new program. I think they were oh. trying to like implement their clothing and. Interesting, okay. So yeah, I just remember getting that phone call and being like, yes, 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 I'll do it right now. Like wow. whatever, let's do this. And I'll, you know, whatever. And so, yeah, that's kind of how that went. And I was, then I got excited and I wasn't filming for Pretty Sweet, but like, you know, when you get a new sponsor, you mm -hmm. kind of give, gives you new yeah, you pizzazz. And for sure. Like, All right. And so then I started filming for Pretty Sweet, but this was like, oh, this is another reason why I didn't start filming for Pretty Sweet. It's like, I know when fucking the ads for Fully Flared came out, it was two years after the video. I mean, it was two years before the video actually came out. So mm -hmm. I'll wait until the, the I'll start filming when it's time <laughs> exactly when the ads start coming out yeah okay <laughs> and that was just so happened that nike i, I got on nike you had some like time. vans footage and we went back and reshot a couple things maybe like the the wally nose willie at dorsey and all that stuff oh really yeah you were wearing vans the first time oh we i didn't know that it with nike. i mean I, I, I remember it now but i remember seeing it twice i'm like why the fuck did i film that twice <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, the shoes right i didn't know um that wouldn't be like that these, these days. I'd be like, fuck it. <laughs> yeah, it there. You move on. <laughs> no pro shoe or not. Or I was trying to swing that. I was trying, to trying to I was like, well, I want to, you know. Yeah. But I think they're like, oh, we don't really do that. I was mm. like, okay, whatever. But yeah. then they had like pro, like Paul Rodriguez had a bunch of pro clothing. I was like, all right, well, yeah. hand it over. Right. <laughs> you know, and they're just like, yeah, we're not. And they're like, yeah, we're not going to do that no. for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I was like, I, "Okay, I get She's it." Like, I'll do my own clothing brand. Yeah, yeah. no, 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 no. Right. That was long before that. Were you stoked on Nike and everything? Like, yeah, you, yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah. It was. It was just better than Vans. You were over uh, the whole. Thing bra again. A lot of people on Girl were on Nike. Gotcha. Okay. No one on Girl or Chocolate were, was on Vans. Yeah. Okay. So it, it wasn't really like shared trips. We never really had anyone on Vans. No, Elijah was on Elijah. Vans. Elijah. Yeah. 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 But, but uh, yeah, there wasn't like, so I was like, Brian, you're on. I love traveling with you, blah, right. blah, blah. I kind of like realized like, you got to like get on the teams that you like to hang out with. For sure. I didn't, I was just like, oh, cool. Like hang out with other people. Right, right, right. Not the case. How's yeah. it hang with Nigel? He's good. Yeah. <laughs> we text all the time. All the time. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah. What do you guys talk about? Nothing, because he doesn't text. He doesn't text back. <laughs> That's a one-sided. Yeah. Yeah. You want to go eat? No, Still nothing. waiting. Still waiting. <laughs> Still waiting. Maybe one of these days. We'll yeah, text yeah. You back. Hopefully. And then so yeah. So then you started. Uh, so pretty sweet. What they started doing the uh, ads for it. You started filming for pretty sweet. Is right, right. Good? I was like, all right, start. Time to go. It's time to go. Yeah, right. The bus is here. Uh, so yeah, we started filming a lot, and I just got. Yeah, like I said, I got on Nike, and mm -hmm. that was like a, a you know. A, f a fresh a breath of air and right. whatever and yeah we filmed that and then i remember going to the premiere and just like after the at, at the end i started just crying what do you mean what? like literally crying just like this is four years of this i just hated how it turned out and i just remember oh. like driving just 
crying, like sobbing. Really? Yeah, you yeah, had, yeah. You hadn't seen anything yeah. I hadn't until... Seen, oh, I saw my part, and we were trying to skate to like a Beastie Boys song from uh-huh. Paul's Boutique on like the, the like the very end song. Oh, okay. I, I can't remember the name, but it's like whatever, track 15 on Paul's oh, Boutique. Okay. And it looked really cool, and then I just remember like, you know, like, all right, we're going to skate. We're going to put like Brian and Carol in your part and all this I was like, all right, cool. And it looked really good. Yeah. And then I remember like not seeing it again and then seeing the premiere and being like, I hate this. Really? I hate like, why do they do these camera angles and all this, you know, the tie, oh. the tie thing. It just wasn't my. Was there a when, cup of tea? When you and I first Literally. started filming together, you're like, can you not break out the crane or the yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You had it. Yeah, I had it all. Right, right, right. And like, exactly. you get like bummed out every time I break it out. Like, can we just like shoot with the, like the normal camera? I'm like, yeah, sure. Right. But like, you know, feds had the fucking. Yeah, he's running around with the fucking ray gun. Right, right, right. right. Exactly. And it's just like, it just became too much at at that point. Right. Which is cool. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm hyped that you said that too because it made filming more fun again. Well, it was just like, it just, yeah, it made it like a production. But again, like, it's cool because Ty was pushing something that hadn't been done. Yeah. You know, but like, not everyone was up for the the challenge, I guess. Right. But, uh, yeah, so did that. And then I just remember, yeah, I remember just, I think I had, I got broken up with right before Pretty Sweet come out okay. came out, and I was just like that. I'm sure that you know some of those emotions, emotions were <laughs> right. you know stacked on on the emotions of seeing that. Yeah, yeah. And I was waiting for like the like the like same effect when your name comes up, and I'm like that. Where where did that go? Yeah, I was like waiting for that. I'm like that didn't happen. No. Yeah. No. And so. <laughs> yeah. So then I was just like done. Done. Uh, it was just like this sucks. Yeah. Like I, said, I wish it like why couldn't we just do it? like why didn't whatever I think we'd all like why doesn't Aaron edit it or whatever and that made you want to quit not not that I wanted to, I didn't want to quit I was just like what's not like I don't want to do like uh, we did two of these okay. I I didn't like I liked fully flared right but then I was also I was like this is kind of a cheesy video mm. at the time mm-hmm. and I, you know I was just like I want to just do like a normal skate video right you know. And, th- and then right before Pretty Sweet came out, Bill was getting in our ear about like, you and Dylan should do a company and like, it'd be sick, mm. you know, blah, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. And I was like- Team Handsome. No, no, it wasn't that. <laughs> <laughs> but it was like, do, you know, like do that. You, you Dylan and Austin should do a company and blah, blah, blah. And I remember sitting down talking with Dylan and like, right before, he was like, let's do it. And I'm like, yeah, I don't want to quit girl though. Mm-hmm. I mean, I don't, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm like, I'm down to do it, but I'm, Mike and Rick gave me my start. Like, there's no way. Yeah. I don't. I, I don't. I feel super uncomfortable leaving them in the dust. So I was like, I'll do it if they're okay with it. You oh. know. And if you. And so, I remember Dylan's like, okay. And so he called Mike. Without I didn't know he called Mike. He called Mike. Yeah. He's like, hey, we, I want to do a company with Alex. Blah blah blah. Wow. And Mike was like, uh, you know, like Mike was like, I can't even think about this right now. Oh, yeah. He like called me. He's like, uh, dude, I don't even know what to say. Like, are you going to be in this video? I'm like, yeah. But like, he's like, I don't, I don't even like, I don't know what, to, like, we got to talk about this after. Right. I'm like, all right. Well, I don't know, whatever. It was just an idea, you know? Yeah. And so I think that was like where that, that bug got planted. Okay. And, like, and then after the video came out, I was like, let's start this let's. <laughs> <laughs> you know it's time uh yeah but you got on 3d though for a second right before this is before 3d and oh. and and dylan dylan i th- oh gravis and uh analog had cut their their mm. stuff and mm. so he was like i'm not gonna quit my board sponsor i have no sponsors i won't you know oh god okay. I'm like, all right all right well i'll wait right. like whatever and then just like like let's let's start this though you know the time is now and like mm-hmm. anthony and ave started or they were starting to like do fucking cool, awesome right. and then brian was thinking about doing it was originally called deer okay d-e-a-r mm-hmm. apostrophe right uh and then he was doing that and then i remember him calling me he's like i think about i want i'm gonna quit girl yo Do, would you want to skate for my company and i'm like oh yeah of course wow you know, and I got closer and closer with Brian once mm-hmm. I when I was on Girl, mm-hmm. and uh, yeah, I was like, yeah, I'm down. Like, okay, like I, I'm just I don't feel like what they're doing right now is what isn't in line with what I want to do. You, okay, because I was like in my head, I was like, I want to just do a company with Logan Lara. Oh yeah, Logan. Yeah, yeah. But I, I I didn't like 
I think I was like romanticizing that like Neil Blender just quit at GNS and like <laughs> did Alien, yeah. and okay. I was just like romanticizing that idea with with Logan, mm. just being like whatever. And Polar had just started coming out, and they had a video, and Palace started coming out, and yeah, they had their yeah. videos, and I was like. It, it was kind of a shift in the... Well, it was just like, this isn't serious. This is like fun. Right. You know, like these guys aren't like killing themselves. These guys aren't taking themselves so serious. Mm -hmm. It was like, again, something nice to like see. It was a change. And so I was like, I want to do that, you know? And so Brian Brian approached me for, I, I was like, I could never do a company by myself. Like, I don't, whatever but like i want to do yeah. like if if this isn't happening i'm gonna maybe do that right, i don't i don't Dylan know what wanted, the, he wanted to stay on alien and yeah i just was, didn't know what the next step yeah. was and so brian did his thing and i remember he moved to new york and i i don't know yeah i started to i think i just started getting a place out there and i was like sending him we were sending ideas back and forth but he would never show me anything and i would just be like what about this what about this and he wouldn't really like communicate and mm. I was just like all right whatever and then I was trying to like be like what up Austin like excited and Austin wasn't really texting me back either and I was like okay this is weird you but have a problem right. with people not texting <laughs> Nigel, you know, everybody yeah. yeah but this actually happened okay <laughs> <laughs> um yeah. so down the line he's like showed me like two weeks before the graph and I'm like dude this this looks exactly like girl and skate mental. Like mm. this is supposed to be different. Like why did we just quit to do the same, same thing, thing right? you know? So I'm like, I, I don't think I'm down. Like I, I, I want to get away from this. Right. You know? Uh, and it, it just sucked, you know, like he was like definitely really hurt by it. Mm -hmm. And like, I, you know, I don't think, may, I don't know, you know, he was really sad about it. And yeah. Uh, yeah, I just remember like, I, I don't think I can do this. You know what I mean? I'm like, look, like, we quit for a reason. I was going to do my company. I was going to do a company, but you know, this isn't what I thought was in line with what we were going to do. And so I quit and I was like, it's better. I quit now before it comes out. Yeah. yeah. Before boards yeah. are made. Yeah. Right. Or not even bored. I'm just like before, like everything's said and done. Mm -hmm. and, and so, Oh, and then I remember him changing the name from Deer because I was like, I was like, that's sick. It's a great that's name, a cool yeah. name. And then he's like, I'm gonna change it to 3D. Like two weeks later, before it came out, I was like, what? No, 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 3D. Yeah. And then there was like, there's, you know, people are like, oh, there's 3D innovations though. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, Matt. And so, like, you know, there was like all this confusion about that, and I was like, oh, I don't know, it's a weird name. But then I was like, all right, it's cool. Like I was starting to try to make graphics and I was like, you know, like placing three D's in weird configurations okay. and whatever. And uh, yeah, it just didn't work out. This yeah. wasn't my vibe. Okay. And so I was like, all right. And then I just, I was like, all right, whatever. I, I asked Jim for boards and I was like, oh, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do. Did they make a boards or catalog they, or there's, anything? There's, there... there's a couple board sample boards floating in the universe, but okay. I, don't, I think Eric Anthony has it. Oh. Someone has it. Okay. Because I remember my friend Jeff was like, I'm, I need that board. Oh, really? Yeah, there's like one or two out there. But even if you were tr getting, you, you, you just weren't feeling, even if you could do your own graphics for your boards and stuff, it just it wasn't the It wasn't the, 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 the direction thing. that uh, okay. I thought it was supposed to be going in. Because wow. it, it wasn't Brian's artwork. And Brian has these like amazing, yeah. amazing uh, sketchbooks, For like sure. books and books of them. And yeah. I was just like, okay, oh, hey, like Brian is going to just like use well, all that's this kinda stuff. That's kind of what I pictured. Yeah. Right, yeah. exactly. Yeah. And then it was kind of, it looked like skate mental. And also he, he rushed it for, like Brad was on him to rush and get it out. And I was okay. just like, why are we rushing? Why aren't we just like, this is important. Like you want to make it like a, a statement was, yeah. was coming out the first thing. Definitely. But uh, yeah, so I didn't have a board sponsor and we started filming Cherry. Mm -hmm. And I remember Bill, like right after Pretty Sweet came out, he's like, I'm gonna film the Supreme, I'm gonna be starting to film the uh, Supreme video. And I was like, I don't give a fuck. I'm <laughs> just started, I just filmed Pretty Sweet. I, I could, I'm not touching my board for five months. <laughs> fuck right. off. You know, I said, boy, it's gonna be different. I'm like, I, yeah. It, no, it's not. Yeah. You just weren't in the film at the time. <laughs> yeah, basically, yeah. ever. Right. But uh, yeah, so we, uh, what's it called? We, yeah, I, qu I quit. And then I was like, I got to start a, a company or mm -hmm. I got I to gotta do something. Right. 
and I was entertaining the idea and had all these ideas and so yeah and then we I was like coming trying to come up with names and and is that what is that what, when did Bianca Bianca Shandon so uh I think Palace was like a big it's like oh they're, this is they're doing they're popping off at the time yeah well yeah. they're just like they, it wasn't like what it was now but like they were doing something different right yeah. and I was like it's cool that they're like people that don't skate are wearing it yeah. you know like Rihanna and all that oh, not yeah. that whatever I was just like it it had this motion and it was like in fashion and stuff and me and Dylan had interest and I was like Dylan let's start a company yeah like and he's like yeah I'm kind of into it but I don't know I'm gonna stay on Alien I might get on FA I'm like all right well you know if you and I make a company it'll make some waves blah 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 right, right. but he was you know I think he had his vision and I had mine right was there any talk of you <clears throat> getting on FA yeah uh, Dill offered me I, I when I quit so when I quit 3D and I started my company the person I started with had quit his job to start doing doing uh doing Bianca okay. and I remember Dylan being like just get on FA and really? I was just like no I can't do it someone just quit their job I can't just yeah. like hang, hang oh, him out to dry gotcha you know but Bianca wasn't gonna be a board brand was it I didn't I was just like let's do this experiment and just see what happens I wanna like you know whatever do yeah. I don't even, it was an experiment yeah. I was just like I wanna make some you know try to make nice stuff or whatever yeah so I was like alright we're gonna do this you know let's like take this from fashion and try mm -hmm. to like turn fashion people onto skating and skating on to fashion people and skaters to fashion blah 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 and yeah I think we're, uh, then that's when 917 that's where the first like the number came out because we were still trying to figure out the name okay and I was like well let's let's put out this phone number and then that will be the hashtag and that will go to the inspiration board to to the thing and we'll put call me okay and people won't know what that is but you know and then we'll have the answer machine say Bianca Shandon, but they won't know because it sounds like just a person's name. Oh, right. And so we just started doing doing that. And, and that was all inspired by like rave flyers, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like back in the day, I, th I think there's a um, Beverly Hills 91210 episode where they have to like bring an egg to like the, the clown, the clown <laughs> deli or what, no, the clown liquor Oh, the clown. Okay. Right. And they have to bring an egg and then they get the address. Oh, it's or you, But back in the day, you'd call the you'd call a pager. Or, no, no, you wouldn't call a pager. You'd call a phone number and they would give you the address. Because well, they were so underground. You needed to go to right, a certain right, right, thing right, right, to get right, the, right. Yeah. the address. Or, yeah. Right. So, yeah. To you find out where the party was at. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, it was, it was based off that idea. And so, yeah, so it was just like all these kind of, you know, gathering of ideas and mm -hmm. trying to like put them out and just trying to do something different. Were a lot of people calling? I didn't check the answer machine, but yeah, you we never, did. You didn't check? No, no, it? we did oh. later on, but like the the, the uh, whatever the messages erase after a while. But oh, gotcha. so okay. they self destruct. Exactly, <laughs> mission impossible. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that's when nine one seven came about, and then we finally came out with an interview, or I came out with an interview in Trans World, like an internet one, like oh, it's called Bianca Shandon, and then we like released whatever the clothes and then like uh -huh. the second drop was like lover stuff so what did you do i mean did you stop doing bianca and then just did nine oh no no no, no. so that... so that then bianca started like you know like going going upwards and it was like good yeah. momentum and right. i was like we should start another company that's a skateboard company because that's originally i don't want like we have this window and we're in all these like high-end stores mm. but once skating's not cool they're gonna drop us. Okay. So we might as well make another company that's a skate company for the core. For the core. Gotcha. And that's and I was like, let's just use nine one seven because there's such a, you know, good. There's something there that we can use that's really good. And so that's the birth of nine one seven wow. out of necessity. You I know what I love about your name is that you can put your 917 number on anything it could be a shirt with a right I mean that was the whole idea else. yeah yeah so I, I didn't even realize that you could have like that as a website yeah and I think that was just that came from just going skating I remember like seeing there was there's a spot called Fish Gap and there was like you know the address spray painted on this like cellar door I'm like oh it'd be sick if you name a company an address yeah and then it kind of turned into a phone number and I love it it's great right. yeah. but so that that whole idea of like 
using a phone number and can kind of combine it with anything. Towing company. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you must have checked the messages because you put them in the beginning of the video. <laughs> right, 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 right. right. Well, uh, yeah, and so... I like how you put them in, like, you suck. Like, right, right, <laughs> right. They, they, I mean, I, I, I just, like, I sent that idea to Logan when yeah. he was editing the video because we're like, we don't have an intro, really. Yeah. I was like, well, I always, no, before I was like, let's make, like, a, like, um, like a commercial. And I was like, why don't we just take all the messages and just have the number? Pl-? Right. He's like, why don't we just save that? And I was like, oh, well, we'll never fucking do it. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> and he's like, whatever and so i remember making like the the titles for it Mm -hmm. and i sent him that and he recorded all the messages and picked the ones that he liked well you guys spent a long time making that video right yes and no oh but yes we did (laughs) traditionally yes how many how how long did you take to do that video what happened was i started filming when i started the company okay and i was like i gotta make a promo like this ain't gonna fucking sell itself right you know so i started doing that and then I, I went to film a little thing in Paris with Bill mm-hmm. and that was swoosh. Okay. And I was like, I don't really want to film this because I'm trying to film a video part and I have footage. So like, I want, I'd rather just like keep the footage, but like, okay, we'll go film in Paris, whatever. And I got yeah. a bunch of footage out there and I was like, oh, this is annoying because I would have saved this for my part. And that it kept getting just like chopped down uh, or I was like, oh, all, you know, like Bill had another clip and it got chopped, you know, like a, I t- whatever a clip got taken out okay. from there. So like your motivation, obviously it kind of starts like going down. A yeah, bit, yeah. Declining a little, yeah. not because of him, but just like, yeah. you're just like you, I had like a good amount of footage and then like, you, you know, pieces that, you know, yeah. yeah. You gotta keep all the sponsors happy. No, not even, no, no, I didn't. I was like, that wasn't even the issue but uh yeah so i was starting to film for that and then <clears throat> i got logan i got logan to quit welcome i'm mm. like dude quit that shit <laughs> like I'll, i'm like they don't pay you i'll fucking pay you right like and he's like oh i don't know but okay was he just filming from or was he came from no i was like get on yeah like you're on and he's like yeah i don't know like he's like i'm not i shouldn't be sponsored <laughs> you know i'm like yeah but you're good enough so you're on yeah and so I'm like, and whatever, I'm like, just help me, whatever, build this. And so he got on and I think there was kids around. And I, I remember starting 917 and there was a group of kids from here actually okay. that lived in New York. And I'm like, oh, it's cool. Like, I'll just hook these kids up oh, no. and we'll see what happens. Thinking that if they got hooked up, they would then be like, I got to fucking skate hard. But I realized after that didn't happen, I was like, Oh, these guys are validated already by a pro. They don't need to have to work. They right. They got it. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> so I was like, they didn't. It didn't like I, the way I planned. It didn't work out. My yeah. plan didn't work out. So you didn't fire them up. They're on nine one seven. They're gonna be oh, their no, hunt. Yeah, yeah, well, I was like, just like yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like we gotta get better. Right. Yeah. Did no. not. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking did not happen at all. <laughs> Genesis. I thought he would be like. I was like, he's good, mm-hmm. but like if he if he sees that he can get on, he'll get better. Okay. And or he'll try to get better, but they're just like, yeah, whatever, cool. Right. They were just like blasé cool, about cool. it, kind of. Yeah. No, they're. I mean, they've gotten a lot better, but like it wasn't like I thought they were gonna like you know like try to get become am and get sponsored and like do this whole thing. Yeah. Which is good, but like at that time that was the the trajectory of like where I thought we were going. But uh, so when Logan got on, because I was trying to get, I tried to get Jake on, Jake Johnson. Oh, okay. I tried to get Dylan on. Okay. There's a couple others, but I can't remember. But, and they were just like, yeah, I don't know, Alex. Yeah. You know, so not I, just like, I'm not feeling you. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, okay. So, yeah, that, so I was like struggling trying to get someone on. Okay. And uh, I got Logan on and then that kind of got the other kids on. Oh, sick. So Cyrus, the, I think Cyrus was on hops. He was on hops. Oh. And then he got on Polar. Did he from Jamal? Yeah, sorry. I didn't steal him from Jamal. Pontus stole him from Jamal. <laughs> <laughs> he stole himself from Jamal. But uh, so, yeah, so he got on Polar. Mm-hmm. And I think Pontus was uh, a bit strict on like, you need, to, you need to post Instagrams and you need to be like, you know, like very... Mm. Militant, almost. Militant, yeah. yeah. So I think he was off, and I was like, dude, dude, I know how that is. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Right. I don't. I won't push you to. Well, you, you're the boss Dope. of yourself. 
just coming from whatever I, I had dealt with before, sure. which sure. I, you know, but at the same time, I, I know that you, someone wants to be pushed. You know what I mean? There you go. It's a double edged sword, right? Yeah, right. Like, yeah. Which I'm not good at at all. <laughs> anyway, so. How do you motivate your team? I, yeah, I don't know. I don't talk to them. <laughs> <laughs> right. I just, yeah, do your thing. Yeah. You know, uh, but so Cyrus got on. And then there was all timers, and we, so me and Rob Harris and all the kids were all filming. And it was like super right before I, I had just started nine one seven. They had started all timers, but they were making just like cutout boards, mm -hmm. and like it wasn't like a, a team or anything yeah. serious. And I think <clears throat> we both were starting to realize like, oh, these kids are good. Mm. Like, you know, I think I saw Max Max's video part that Johnny Wilson filmed. And I was like, oh, this, like, I've known Max forever from, and I'm like, oh, this guy's serious? Like, yeah. I didn't know this. You know, like, if you go back, if so, there's like probably a, some YouTube of Max Palmer's, like, all his footage. Uh -huh. It's not like, he does some crazy shit. I mean, I know he already does crazy shit, right, but like, right. before people knew of him, mm -hmm. before I even, like, I didn't know. Wow. So, uh, yeah, so I, we just realized that, and I think there was like this tension between me and Rob hmm. of like, who's gonna, who's he gonna skate for, oh. and whatever they went with, they went with the obvious choice. No, <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But <laughs> the lesser of two evils. Yeah, but uh, yeah. So they, yeah, and then we were starting to film it, to film the video, and just like those dudes are like, this is never coming out. You know what I mean? Like why? Because like Logan would be half like he would just be like he'd come you know like come out to New York. And then he would just spend like three months in L.A. and like hang out with his girlfriend. And, like oh, they're like okay. this isn't happening. Because Logan lives out here, right? He lived in New York for the video and then moved back here. Okay, gotcha. But uh, I think the date nine one seven. We're like all right, that's the final cutoff. Yeah. So we're that's it. Nothing. September seventeenth. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. So that like then put on put pressure on and then i was like all right whatever we got we'll come out with and then you know i didn't see any of the footage really no i was like logan like he was like i need a screen like a monitor i'm like all right here's the card go buy a monitor yeah bring it to the office though don't take it to your house <laughs> he's like okay i won't brings it to his house <laughs> right, right. i'm like dude all right come here and we'll edit the video together he's like yeah okay he was he just <laughs> I'm like, dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Come to the office and we can fucking edit this thing. Right. Okay, I will. Never did. Never. <laughs> I'm like, dude, I, can I see what the video even looks like? And he's like, yeah, come over. This is like a week before the video had to come out. <laughs> oh, God. And then I saw him like, oh, shit. We're in fucked. Why, why, do you <laughs> hey, guys, why do you think that? Because it didn't look like it does. Like it was, oh, it, really? we, we saw pieces of it. Okay. It wasn't like... Polish. He was tripping too. Oh, was we he? were just like, uh oh, <laughs> the the message boards are gonna have their <laughs> fucking day. <laughs> day. Yeah, and I was like, oh, this music is whack. No way. Yeah, but I'm like, whatever. It's it's it's, it's what they like. Okay. And it's not me. It's us. You know. Gotcha. And then uh, you know, after watch like, then seeing it for the first time, I'm like, mm -hmm. oh, it's cool. Yeah. I wonder how people like it. And then watching it in the theater and seeing everyone's reaction, I'm like, okay. Phew. I thought it was great. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Right, yeah. but like Good you video, yeah. but being put on that position, you're like Yeah, yeah, for sure. Fuck, I don't know. Yeah. All right, just being like, all right, I'm putting this out, uh, you know, whatever, like my skate footage is in there, but mm -hmm. also like everything's riding on this. On the brand. Yeah. Kind of, yeah, just like, you know, the identity of the brand. Right. So, I love the part where uh the dude's alarms going off and he's oh, like right. turn that thing off and then the next shot is a dude smoking <laughs> smoking you're just sitting there oh, yeah because he him. got he got like it was a vato it wasn't like this dude wasn't like fucking around. he's like what Holmes what oh, he was about to I was like oh fuck but he was we're like, gonna get all, like it was like five to one this guy's gonna kick all our asses <laughs> oh, and he, he was like five there, two yeah. I was like dude this dude's gonna mop us all up was he cool though after the thing or no, he wasn't cool. No. He was like sitting down, like smoking that fucking crazy. It looked like this basically. Yeah, yeah it was a huge. <laughs> and it was just like, I was just like, yeah, you know, he's just trying to concentrate. The car line. No, no, he's like, no, nah, fuck you, fool. Nah, fuck no, fuck you. I'm like, okay, well, I'm just, whatever. And he's like, 
<laughs> smoking, like getting mad at me while smoking. I was like, oh, <laughs> I, I don't know really but what to do in this situation. Just sitting there with yeah, because I was, was after him just telling amazing. me like to shut up. I was like, I had to, I can't. What are you gonna do? I, yeah, I'm not an MMA fighter. If I was, I'd be like, all right, come over here. That's, I'll put you in an arm bar. Did he clap when he landed it? At least, no, nah, probably yeah, not. No. I mean, that guy was probably just getting off his shift. Yeah. Like he was pissed. <laughs> But yeah, there's a lot of, I mean, I think we took a lot from, I was just like, dude, you know, Baker videos are the best. For sure. You know what I mean? There's right. all these little interludes yeah. and, you know, just trying to make it like that. You know what I mean? I, but yeah, of us, great. you know, so. You're working on the new one, right? New video. I don't know what we're doing. No? <laughs> no. Wait a minute, <laughs> what happened to Bianca? Is she's still around. going? Uh, yeah, it's still going. Yeah. It just, it just, it just, I was like, no more skate for Bianca. Okay, so I, you're I still wanted, doing Bianca, but it's, it's a, in a different. Yeah, I was just like, it's, it's in these. It's its own thing. Yeah, it's in, it's in these fashion stores. Okay. I kind of wanted to yeah, make it like, like I feel dresses like it's and stuff. Drop, like it sells out right away. Yeah, that was, that was in the beginning. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Times are slow now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, so, yeah, so uh, what's it called? Bianca is just, it's doing its own thing. Sick. Uh, it's cool i mean it, yeah. it's it's tough it's just me and robin you know oh, really? doing it so okay. it it's it has its challenges yeah because for a while there we you know you bianca this you i would see it around and then i, I after 917 i i didn't see it so i didn't know what was going, going on right right you know? right 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 so i mean it's just like you know doing two companies and i'm like doing most of the graphics and all that yeah. stuff and you know it, how'd you convince robin Fleming to come help you i don't know I, I really thank you. I don't know. <laughs> I, she's awesome. No, she's great. Yeah. So things are going good. Things, things are going, going good. all right. I, 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 yeah, everything's do you, good. Do you have drops for 917 or do you just kind of, are you on a schedule? or do you Somewhat just of a drop? schedule, yeah. but now I'm just like, dude, doing, doing like whatever, doing this, mm -hmm. you get fucking tired and you're just yeah. like, dude, I can't follow a schedule. Right. I, I want to have my own life. Absolutely. So, you know, it starts, you know, it starts uh, un un unwinding and like, right. you're like, fuck, I can't get it done this week. Or yeah. like, I just can't, don't have the. Every day's Groundhog Day. Kind of yeah. like yeah. wake up, you know, do do your morning routine and then go to the office mm -hmm. and then like see the sunset. You're like, oh, another oh, day gone. It didn't skate. Kind of. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So do you, do you go to the office a lot? Or you I mean, I, I was going like every day and like, all right, you have to do a graphic a day or two to graphics a day. Oh, but you can't do that to yourself though. I did. How did that turn out? <laughs> I thought, uh, yeah, it fucking <laughs> unraveled. And right. I was like, fuck, I hate it. Yeah. You design every board? Most of them. I mean, if, if not, if I'm not doing it, so, I mean, also, yes, I do them all. Sorry. <laughs> I was just going to go into it. I was thinking of like, why the graphics suck though. Like the graphics aren't meant to be good. They're like, yeah, graphics are dumb now. You know what I mean? I mean, no, no, no. no. Sorry. No. You I don't think graphics have the same thing as they did in the 90s, the yeah, 80s, yeah, the 70s. Sure. They're so disposable that it's just like, well, you you're going to, you're, you're going to write, mm, you could. Everyone has to change it. It's not one person. Okay. You start a company. We did. It's called the Nine Club. Yeah, right. <laughs> Do you guys make yeah. boards yet? We sell a couple t-shirts. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, but you know what I mean? Know. It's just, it's, it, it gets grueling. Oh yeah, yeah. totally. Right. But it's, it's like, and then you just, there's board graphics that I'm literally like cut and pasting. Like, I don't care. Just, <laughs> yeah. and I'm just like let's see what happens and how do those do the ones that you don't care I think the uh, team I think likes those ones yeah it's funny because sometimes that, that, that happens you know the ones that you really are, work on and they just kind of don't do oh, it yeah, and then the ones that you like, don't care about are the ones that, that there's ones that I'm like fr like frustratingly clicking like I don't fucking care <laughs> but, uh, this has to get done and it's gonna get done within five minutes <laughs> right you know right. Fucking You're like yeah, food yeah. manual, cool. No, not even just like clip art. Yeah, yeah. Vector. All right, it's done. Done. Yeah, and Print. those. Usually, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, all that stuff's hard. And if you don't know printing, like, oh. I'm going back and forth with the the uh, the board company, and they're just like, it needs to be higher resolution. I'm like, I don't know how to do that. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying. Right. And like, dude, figure it but out. Maybe you don't want higher resolution. Maybe you want the. No, I. I, I oh. it, it looks bad because what, you I don't know. DBI? What? You hit him like 72. Uh, Sometimes. Yeah. Where like shit's pick. I'm like, why does it look like this? Uh, it didn't look like this on the file. Right. You know?
Well, yeah. it must be kind of cool too. You got to like now you get to turn people pro. Yeah, that's a weird one. Yeah, yeah. that's what, a weird one. Was it? Was it? Who was the first one you turned pro? Cyrus. Cyrus. Right? Cyrus yeah. is the only pro. Oh yeah, right now. And so, how did you do that? Um, you just give him the board. Be like, here you go, bro. No, it wasn't like. <laughs> Here's a you boys on sale. <laughs> yeah, no, no, it wasn't like I was like, you gotta like this guy's gotta have a big surprise. Okay. You know what I mean? Oh, so you did a you did a surprise. Right, right, right. I think oh. everyone deserves a surprise. Okay. Wait, did you get surprised when you turned pro? We didn't even talk about that. Mm, yeah, not really. No? They like took me in the office like, so Alex, the Kai video came out. So what's next? I'm like, I don't know. I was like, I I'm I think I know what they're gonna ask. Uh-huh, like, right. so do you wanna go pro? I'm like I, I guess so. I mean, you it's your guys' call, not mine. Yeah. Can right. you show my board? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> like I'm I don't know. Do you think I should go pro? And yeah, it was kind of that was basic. Like Okay. Maltos and Mike Maltos were like a little more exciting. Mine was like they brought me into the office and By like, the way, tr- they were trying to film it on a camera. Oh, they like, were. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I was just like, why are you guys filming this? By the way, <laughs> when you turn Cyrus Pro or you decided to turn Cyrus Pro, like was there a demand from shops like asking for his board? No, it's, the guy was just like he was. He put in a, a lot of work and mm-hmm. it was just like. Also, he had another video part that I didn't know that was coming out a month later. I was like, all right, this guy needs to be pro. Yeah. Like the guy's coming out with two parts back to back. Yeah. And uh, so I was just like, yeah. And I was just like, fuck, making a graphic for someone else. Like you're like, this is your first graphic. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm. You're stuck with it. Well, just like you want, you want to make it rememberable. Right. Yeah. You know what I mean? You want to make it like, you want to like try to, you know. Yeah. Yeah, do he it was, for that person. He must have been pretty stoked, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He like started crying. That's amazing. I mean, wow. kind of. How did you surprise him? Did you just? Well, we we ordered all this product first, and then we got all our friends together, okay. and then we we go went to this like this whatever pizza shop that we always go to to eat, mm-hmm. and it just so happened like all right, all, like his girlfriend was texting us like all right, we're almost there. And like, she like, we're in the back, we're sitting down. Okay. We're like, all right, we're gonna come. And we all rushed in and somehow he was in the bathroom. So when oh. he came out, it was just all of us with boards. No way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so it was like probably also like him just being scared. Like, what the <laughs> fuck? Cause it was like empty. And then when we came in, we like full, full yeah. Wow. That's pretty rad. That's, That's rad really though. Yeah, yeah, it worked so out like really well. What? He blew up the bathroom and came out the Yeah, bat. basically. Yeah. <laughs> and like, I think he got in a fight with his girlfriend. Oh. Uh. Cause she's like, She's oh, whatever. She's like, hey, just come meet me at the pizza store. She's like, no, come here. He's, she's like, I gotta tell you something. Uh-oh. He's like, oh, what? Right. Okay, what's up? She's like, nothing. Oh God. And yeah. he's like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> you know. By the way, when because you and Mike Mo were kind of on the same come up level, right, right, know, right. Was there ever any tension? Between... I mean, I would say Mike Mo was like this. I'm like, no, but you guys were. I mean, you, you were know, on the, the same. Back, uh... Like, you guys were kind of coming up in the same years. You know, right, 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 right. Was there? Did you ever feel any tension there? Oh yeah, or... definitely. You really? Oh yeah. Was the age of Malto? The age of Malto? No, Malto. For some reason, Malto. I was just like, he's. He's Malto. Malto's Malto. Yeah, right. exactly. <laughs> but Mike Mo bugged me for some reason. Oh, he did. I mean, it was just like little kid beef. <laughs> yeah. Like, fuck you. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I think it bugged me that I was like, this guy doesn't skate transition. Mm. Like, he can't, like, what, whatever. You know, can't the rumor was he, he could only blunt to fake. Okay. I was just like, you cannot be a pro skater and fucking only be able to, like, ride up and down a ramp. <laughs> In my book, I was just like, but this is, like, little kid shit. But he was fucking killing it, though, Right, too. right. But like, I'm just like, you got to be... Yeah. Um, in, well, you, coming from my dad, right. where, like, yeah, growing yeah, up... Yeah. yeah. Where he's like, these motherfuckers suck at skating now. And yeah. watching, like, Jeremy Klein and stuff. Yeah. Watching, the, like, the whatever, the end. And he's like, these guys are the worst. <laughs> He's like, Christian Hosoi is the best street skater. Yeah. And like now comparing, I'm like, this dude was jumping off ramps. Right, right. And you're comparing this to like someone like grinding rails and oh stuff. Oh, God. But uh, I mean, it just kind of came from, he's like, none of these guys have styles. Jay Adams, that's someone that had style. Right. You know, so I like have that ingrained in the back of my head. And then here's Mike Mo. <laughs> right. And so I was just like, <clears throat> Like again, I said, this little kid. You guys should do something. Well, how do you like, I mean, with the, I mean, I guess Instagram and everything, but like that nowadays it's harder, right? To, to do like, how do you go and market? I th- like, I don't know. Your, the do whole have... Instagram thing is fucked. Yeah. I mean, it's just like, it, I think it was really fun and like guy and like when the, the beginning stages of Instagram with right. Mark and all those guys mm-hmm. and 
was putting out footage, it became really interesting. Yeah. And it was a new tool. Mm-hmm. But now it's just like, it just took over and it's like. Yeah, yeah it's oversaturated. I mean, I don't know, you know, it, it, we don't really, we're not that heavy on Instagram, I Ads guess. Ads and Thrasher maybe? Do you do? Mm, no. No? I mean, it's just like, it's cool. But yeah. like at the same time, I, I feel like, it's an expensive. It is. Where it's are you expensive spending marketing dollars? Not there. No <laughs> offense to them. It's just it's just expensive and like it's a, it, it, it's a digital era. So yeah, not weren't many people like, are gonna see it. Were you super big on Tumblr or is that? Still- I was. I was the Tumblr king. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I was at one point. I never really got into that at all, but I always knew that like you were really into that, and I don't. Yeah, it sounds so bad. Being, like <laughs> being confronted with that. No, uh, no, I don't know. I just. I, I don't yeah I don't know yeah I was just like into Tumblr I guess at one point just posting stuff and that was like before any of that stuff was happening I remember being I was in China and something happened between you and Costin it oh was, funny you say that because I, re- <laughs> I read that recently I'm like that's actually a really sweet nice message <laughs> like it, like it, if you read it, it like what was it for, what, what happened I, I was just talking shit about the barracks and I think uh, Barra said something to Dylan I think it was along the lines of Dylan like try to say like was trying to be cool to Barra mm-hmm. and Barra had just gotten kicked off Alien and thought probably Dylan and Anthony and Ave had something to do with I it I mean and Dill yeah had something to do well Dylan had something to do with it mm-hmm. and I think he, he just like he was like oh hey what's up and try to shake his hand he's like you're trying to shake my hand and I heard that and I was like fuck this guy yeah and then I think that's where like Oh, you know, kids were asking me like, "Do you skate the barracks?" Blah blah. blah. I'm like, "Fuck him!" Like, yeah, whatever, uh, you know. Or do you watch the barracks? And I was just like, "Fuck him," you know what I mean? <laughs> and then I think Eric just stepped in. Yeah, I read that message and I was like, oh, "That was actually a really sweet message." Like, it's not, it it seems mean, but like it's actually like he's actually uh, it's pretty sincere. What was the? Do we remember the message? Ah, uh, fuck, I don't know. It was just like you, you know, you you have a great opportunity. Don't like ruin it basically oh, yeah. and i was like i was like yeah again uh, being a dickhead kid and then being a little more mature being like oh right he was looking out yeah you know it's uncle good, eric uncle eric he's <laughs> a good dude well i hope you guys do something great i mean i hope you guys do something <laughs> thank fun. you yeah me too uh no i just i like the vibe of the company i like the right. vibe thank of the video you. was thank fucking you. sick you know right uh, yeah i don't know yeah. it's hard to live up to like once you put uh, yeah but you just you keep doing cool shit though you know, right, I mean, I just think, yeah, just don't think about it. Yeah. How many employees do you have? Uh, there's get things me, done. Robin, Marcus, Calvin, and then there's a couple of new guys that come in and out. Do you but it's, uh, it's, it's four. Are you like the art uh, no, director? No, no, it's three, really. Am I the art director? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So you're, you're basically doing all the graphics and everything. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we send some stuff out. I, there's a couple of people that get stuff. Gets it, right. But not many. And mm-hmm. it's just like... You know, and then it's two companies. So, anything else going on with you besides skating and and all this stuff? What do you What do you do? You oh, you do music and stuff, right? Oh uh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I mean, I I try to. How's that going? It's a, you know, it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> no, I only say that because it's just like I wish I started a lot younger. Okay. I, I I did, but I didn't like have the the knowledge to like sit there and practice. Right, right. Uh, you know, and I think if any kid trying to learn skating yeah. should take up an instrument because there's a, a, a you'll become more disciplined trying to learn an instrument oh, yeah. and then you can apply that to skating to learning stuff what about the mouth harp do you ever no no no, no no the electric harp's fun but uh what yeah what I'm trying to like uh i started playing bass i think after dylan passed away mm. for what for some odd reason like i'm gonna start playing an instrument because he used to like playing instruments oh okay or playing the guitar but i'm like yeah. i'll play bass Oh yeah. For I don't know why. Right. But I was yeah. So I was like, I'm gonna learn the bass. Good and at then, it. You good? I'm, I'm decent. Getting better. I'm getting better. Sick. I mean, I could I could have like a in depth conversation. Not in depth conversation. You, I can be like, oh, you're playing the sixth to the third to the you know that. Oh, you're shit. learning the actual. Oh wow. Yeah yeah. I see. I don't the know. Tonics. The tonics. The yeah. tonics. You actually like um, play along. I get naked in the mirror and play. <laughs> slap the bass. No, no. What? Yeah. Do you play along with songs, or do you just try to you just jam by yourself, like uh, mm. like try to make up a song? You know or what? I like... I cannot sit there and learn a song. No. It drives me nuts. Oh. I'd okay. rather I learn the scales. 
Mm. and then or the modes of the scales okay. and then be like oh it's in d dorian mm. all right and then just know the notes from there and that right. it's much easier and much f more fun oh and that's the i think the correct way you're supposed to learn okay because so yeah, yeah, when you play a, learn a song you're not learning the structure of why the song works the way it works so learning that way my way right. or whatever the the, the way the, the way yeah the awesome way the, no, no no not my way <laughs> but uh, the theory way uh -huh. you can up, then apply it to any song and be like oh it's in a you know a minor mm. there's these chords that go in with it and if it's not there's you know there's it's, it, it then becomes yeah it becomes yeah. a puzzle oh. which makes it much easier to learn the only thing it it sucks is like getting the the muscle memory the muscle memory so if, if people are jamming if somebody's playing the drums and they got a guitar going and maybe like a keyboard can you jump in there and 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 yeah i could but i pr would probably be like dude you should leave <laughs> <laughs> that i don't know I, I i think i've become a weird health nut are you you're healthy now I am healthy. Oh. <laughs> I'm woke. What do you <laughs> As they say. What are you, you uh, vegan? I am vegan. Vegan. How long have you been vegan? Uh for a year, year and a half now. Something was it like that. hard to jump on was it hard to do that? I think that was another you know, thing with Dylan. Oh really? And my my grandmother was sick too, and then I was just like I think also my knees were hurting, I was getting older, and I think I had watched this guy, John Joseph. Okay. And he was just like, whatever, whatever, he just had something. And I was like, oh, this guy's not a weird, like, vegan freak. This guy's like a hardcore <laughs> punk rock guy that's like kind of funny, has a New York accent. Okay. And uh, I was like, why don't I just try it just to see, like, yeah. what what happens? Because I used to have crazy, crazy stomach issues. Oh, really? Like, would, like, just, you know, it, it came on from, I think, a trip in Quicksilver where we went to Peru. Mm. And... uh I remember getting sick out there and then just ever since that I would always just be like oh I feel sick I can't go out today weird yeah 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 and then I just stopped eating meat and dairy and uh how's, just, how's the stomach now I don't have any issues really? ever no none do you but I mean this was like I this was like six out of out of seven days I would have this issue it started again it got that bad oh seriously? so I, wow. I cut the alcohol first okay I yeah. got broken up with as well and I was okay. like I'm going to do something. A, I'm going to text someone something really dumb or do something really dumb with my car. So I'm like, all right, I'll cut that out first. Okay. That worked, but then there was still, I don't know, I was drinking like two coffees a day, mm. blah, blah, blah. And so, I, I don't know, I just cut out all that bullshit. Interesting. Yeah, and you know, and do, you, started but, reading a lot about it. Oh, you did? Uh, see, that's a, it's, it's almost like you have to do homework to become yeah. a vegan. Yeah, once you start reading about it, yeah. you know, I don't think you want to start eating that shit again. You don't yeah. miss a good steak and uh, mashed potatoes. And I can get mashed potatoes. Well, with, the ma <laughs> with the steak, the mashed potatoes uh, with the steak, or no? No, not or really. Chris, I mean, I just, because nice you know what? I remember eating a steak and just, just, just drilling my stomach where I'm like, oh, it just made oh. me feel sick. And then you think about like, you're eating like a dead carcass actually pretty much no right but you know then there's all you know whatever if you follow like vegan instagrams they're like there's all these like weird memes that are like you know like steak is just you know a dead body with a bunch of herbs on it that are you know that make it taste good we covered a lot man you fucking killed it you get some high fashion for him he doesn't want any nine club shit do you well, maybe a, 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 a mug a mug, a mug. Which one? Kelly go, go which mug do you want do you want an apple yard mug do you want one of those no I just want, want the black? nine club did my dad get one of these no we didn't even have them then oh, perfect you want a black one or a white one well, get one them both. of each oh thank you Kelly bro. Yeah. thank you thank you the nine club nine club dual mug look black and white you know her and his yeah, that's right his and hers there you go take all three with you i'll take two take all four all four <laughs> exactly take whatever you want well dude thanks for coming dude thanks for this having has been me amazing it's man. been a blast yeah and uh good luck with um 917 and bianca and all the stuff that you're doing can't wait to thank see, you uh, thank you i keep making jokes that i'm gonna get logan to, i'm i've told him that he has to come on the show oh, that would be, be awesome that would be awesome yes. like, dude why i keep oh. i tell him amazing he's like does anyone even know who logan is doesn't like, matter yes yeah. and Yes, he has to go on the show. Yeah. As Dude, punishment, though. Tell, oh, as pun... What do you... This is great. But he doesn't know you guys. 
I know, I know you guys. Logan, I know, well, I don't know him that well, but yeah. But he's a he's a Malibuan. Yeah. Or I don't know what you would call I him. I love but, all the West Siders, bro. But yeah, you, you know, know, there's a, a there's yeah. a connection. Of course. Tell him. You know, Elijah's a Malibu. Yep. There's a couple others I can't think of though. But it, there's not many. No. Get Nottis on yeah. here. He's a neighbor. I know. Hit him up. It'd be so good. He'd be very quiet. A lot of people surprise me though when they get in that chair sometimes. Yeah. You know, right. they come through. You just gotta get like a. We gotta get new chairs. No, no, not new chairs. It's a mat. No, Craigslist. Matt? Craigslist. Oh, when you go get your little thing tomorrow, we'll get, no, no, no. no. Grab I'm, a, I'm telling you, Craigslist is the literally. Yeah, legit. I'll look on look Craigslist up, and I'll if I'm and, a little butt mat. No, no, I'm no, not, no, I'm I'm butt, not, no, no, no. That's definitely you don't get that. You get a chair. <laughs> you don't get fucking linens. <laughs> <laughs>